Hi. <laughs> Hello. Hi. 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 <laughs> I have arrived. Did it work? Did it work? Hello. Hi. 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 Hi, everyone. How are you doing? Jump scare me? Never. Never. Not as impressive. What do you mean? Not as impressive. Everyone's a critic today. I can't believe this. I cannot believe this. I cannot believe this. <laughs> Not scared today. You are jump scaring us. No, I was actually, I was actually just kind of waiting. <laughs> I was actually just kind of waiting. Like, when do I switch? Should I switch at four or should I switch at three? And I was debating. And then I just kind of said, like, you know what? We're just gonna, we're just gonna switch. Whatever. <laughs> we're just gonna switch. I was expecting the jump scares it didn't work. Man. Did I love Inter Shorter? No, because I had to go get water. <laughs> it wasn't as chaotic as yesterday. Yesterday was like six minutes. And the only reason it was six minutes was because of the entire mess that proceeded to happen yesterday. <laughs> Pokemon team, this should be interesting. Yes, we are making Pokemon teams for everyone. For all the members of Pixel Star. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have to wait for us to drop our guard first. One day. One day. Do you ever get any of that jello? No. <laughs> Actually, when I went to check, it was already clean. Someone cleaned it. So, yeah, it was already clean. So I'm like, no one knew. <laughs> one day she starts streaming before time. I think that would actually wouldn't 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 work. It wouldn't really work if I start um, uh, stream before time. I feel so. Well, clearly someone knew that they cleaned. <laughs> true, 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 true. Did you get up some jello yesterday? Me never. Never, never. Nope. What if everyone knew but just kept their silence? What do you mean by that, huh? What do you mean by that? So, hi, hi, Cody. Welcome, welcome. Stream before time, how it worked before. <laughs> touche, touche. Yes, Katsubra's yellow. No! You're not supposed to, 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 to elaborate on that. You're not supposed to elaborate. But yeah, hi, hi, Cody. Hi, hi, Katsu. Welcome, welcome. You're not supposed to elaborate on that story. They knew Adele was dropped, not who dropped. <laughs> True. True. MG, hi, Chiaki. Hi, hi, Jealous. Welcome, welcome. Hey, Katsubro, por si no sabías que eres un desastre. Oi, oi. Are you a snitch? Are you, are you snitching on me? I can't believe this. I thought all the Katsus were supposed to be on my side. I cannot believe this. I cannot stand by this. <laughs> I cannot. I can't believe this. You know what happens to snitches around here? Exactly. You know what happens when someone snitches, do you? That's it on snitch never. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Lopon is a good Pokemon to have as a companion on your journey. Hmm. I was thinking I was thinking whether I would make the teams competitive or I would make them like just fit um, Welcome to Nylena. I guess just fit everyone's themes. I feel if I make them competitive it might be harder. Cause like I will have to actually balance things around. I was thinking about it. I was considering. Like, should we make them competitive? If I if I'm gonna make them competitive, I'm gonna have to Google a lot of things. Since I don't really like uh play Pokemon competitively. I know the gist of, like, certain Pokemon. Well, competitive, I'm so ready for this. <laughs> Aye, we're gonna make competitive builds. <laughs> I think this way Thieves is better. Competitive really limits the Pokemon you can choose. I mean, I guess, yeah, it does really limit. It's more like you will have to work with the Pokemon you have. It's not that it really limits. Because um, anything can be competitive if you try it. I mean, didn't you guys know about the guy that won, like, a Pokemon championship with a Pachiritsu? And Pachiritsu is not competitive. It all depends on your team builds. And, you know, your optimal natures and IVs and all that stuff. <laughs> uh, 
the Pachiritsu is going in. Yeah, there was that one guy that won that Pokemon competition with a Pachiritsu. So, if that doesn't tell you that you can win with anything, I don't know what will. <laughs> Which PvZ versus mode was more competitive? PvZ? Pans versus Zombies? The Pachiritsu thing was a very good to be honest. Really, it was. In tournament strategy series, in PvP, normally you better pray for luck. Mm, makes sense, honestly. All depends on your team counters and synergy with moves. I guess it kind of honestly really just depends on, like... What setups you have. Ironically, Pachirita was a meta pick on that year. That's crazy. That's honestly really crazy. I'm not good at Pokemon at all. I, I've never really, like, battled competitively. Like, I've tried building some, um... Competitive Pokemon before, but... Never really actually, like, gone to tournaments or stuff like that. Only really done, like, some, like, random online battles. I've seen people defeat legendaries with the Bidoof, so... <laughs> it is possible, but I feel it'll be way too complicated, I feel. Like, trying to make everything work... Um, would be way, way, way too complicated. Way too complicated for its own good, I feel. Uh, I've tried and realized how much of a pain it would be to manage and train up teams and gave up. You really have to, like, uh, breed Pokemon competitively and all that stuff. It's definitely an investment that I don't know if I would want to do. <laughs> I don't know if it's an investment I would personally want to do. It's too much. Too much, too much. Dude, but I found a way to break a meta player. Wait, you have? Pretty interesting. I build competitive mods, but use them for random fun online. I mean, I think that's also pretty valid. To just use them for, for funsies. Gaggy Esports Arc Len. I... I don't think... I honestly... Unless it was like a game that I really... Liked... To the point that I can uh, play it competitively. I don't think I would, honestly. Like I said, I'm not really a competitive um, type of person, so... I don't know. Ozo, hi, hi, Star! Welcome, welcome! To be honest, if you do any game competitively, you basically dedicate your whole, your whole life to it. Yeah, that's kind of like the big thing with competitive for me. I feel, at that point, it's very easy that you just won't enjoy the game anymore. Because you've been dedicating so, so much time to it, that it's just not fun. Which, that's kind of like the sad part for me. I went through my competitive arc back in college, high school, never again. Ooh. A competitive arc, huh? But yeah, yeah. Jackie will do speedruns while competing in esports. <laughs> oh my god. It's kind of like the same thing with speedruns. I would have... I'll have to reach a point where I just learn the game so much. That I don't know if the game would even be fun at that point anymore. There's the, that big debate with me. I got you on the competitive side team building. Is my passion more so than battling itself? I'll spend days just making teams, really? But I play and speedrunning are the same in that they are... Levels of dedication. Mm, yeah. I mean, you do have to dedicate a lot, a lot, a lot. The game starts to feel stale when there's nothing new to learn anymore. Sometimes, though. Mm, I would say so, yeah. If you already know everything at that point, it's... I wouldn't say it's that fun. Because you'll be like, oh yeah, I know this. I already know how it goes. So, would it really be that fun? It's complicated. Why is it not picking up Clip Studio Paint? My OBS is not detecting Clip Studio Paint for whatever reason. Uh, that is... That is annoying. Why are you not picking it up? OBS? Yeah, it's not picking it up. Yeah, that's annoying. Kinda of story sounds like I had with some speedrunners being so focused on speedrunning that they went into a degenerate state when they barely eat, shower, or go outside for months on end. Jeez. That's crazy. That is way too crazy. 
Honestly, I've been doing competitive Pokemon for years and still learn new things every day. It's a super complex game. I mean, I feel like the meta with Pokemon, it changes every new generation. Because every new every new Pokemon generation is gonna have different Pokemon that may be better than, you know, what was considered good before. So I feel... I feel it's kind of hard to always be a full master. The best fun of building a team is trying to incorporate your favorite mon, which is what I want for my teams. Ooh, that, that's a pretty good, um... That's a pretty good point. Because you wanna... You wanna use Pokemon that you actually, like, like, instead of just what's strong. Our Pokemon and Pro Series Pokemon role playing a trainer in real Pokemon world, since they do it for a living. Mm. Maybe? And even just the DLCs, they really changed the meta too. Oh yeah, the DLCs when they add new new Pokemon. The meta for Pokemon changes like every month, really? It changes that fast. I thought it would only change that fast for the TCG. Which I never learned how to play. Like I found my old Pokemon cards. I mentioned this in another stream. And I I never learned how to play, so <laughs> they're kinda just sitting there. Why is it not capturing it? Not gonna lie, finding a good name for my Pokemon was also a huge deal. Ooh, are you the type that nickname Pokemon? Do you do you actually give your Pokemon nicknames? I for the longest time I didn't really give my Pokemon nicknames. <laughs> I think I I only really like started giving them nicknames when I did Nuzlocks. But um other than that, I I pretty much never give them names. <laughs> Uh, so they were just like, oh yeah, it's just like that Pokemon. Yeah, I remember catching a shiny in Scarlet and Violet and was so dedicated to making it work on the team. Really? I, I heard a lot of people saying that they found a lot of shinies in Scarlet and Violet. I found zero shinies, by the way. The only shinies I ever found in the wild were from... Um, uh, were from uh, Pokemon Arceus. I never actually found shinies in Scarlet and Violet. <laughs> and I remember I tried shiny hunting and it, nothing would spawn. No, no matter how much time I spent, nothing would spawn. <laughs> I, I remember I was trying to uh, hunt a shiny braviary. Because I, I thought shiny braviary was really, really cute. And I was like, oh my god, I really like that. You still remember your first shiny ever? Uh, I don't remember what my first shiny ever was because I think I got it on a wonder trade. So I I don't remember exactly which one it was. <laughs> shiny farming requires preparation. Usually there's a strat for doing it. Yeah, I remember looking up at the strats and everything, but nothing would really show up. <laughs> Oh man, you do know what they say, a lucky in the game, luck in the heart. <laughs> luck in the heart. I mean, I found two shiny fledglings during my first Scarlet playthrough. That's so lucky. That's insanely lucky. Okay, yeah. For some reason, it's just not capturing Clip Studio Paint. I've been trying to capture it. But it just won't pick it up, even though I already tried closing and reopening the program. Why is OBS like this? Let me try... Making a new capture. Maybe that will do? Capture third party overlays? I don't... It's just refusing to capture it, huh? No, you guys a window? Nope. It's not capturing whatsoever. Um, I'll try making a new source, maybe? Okay, what about this? That's not what I wanted to capture. Okay! Okay, now finally. Why is it capturing it like half? Uh, do not save. I want you to... Oh, it closed Clip Studio Paint! Oh, great. That's lovely. <laughs> Literally not detecting the, prog the program at all. Yes, it's not... I managed to get it to detect the program, but then it closed itself. 
So that was that was all part of the plan. Okay, can you please cooperate with me? I would really appreciate that. Uh, fit to screen. Don't make it too big. Despite my monitor. It keeps cutting off the side. Okay, I think I made it work. Let me check that it's... Okay. I think that should work. OBS just saying, nah, no Clip Studio paid for you. So, so evil, man. Why are they like this? Okay. Okie dokie. Let's see. Clip Studio paid being shy today. No. In times of desperation, you can always use Pokemon Showdown's team builder instead. Uh, never tried Pokemon Show... Pokemon Showdown. Pokemon Showdown Battle Simulator. Where's the team builder on this? I've never used this one. Team builder. Do you have a good day? Uh, uh, worst neutral. Sure. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, new boxing team. <laughs> yeah, that was like the first thing it asked me. Hi, do you have a good day? And I was like, where's the neutral option? Uh, new team. Select a format. Oh god, there's too many formats. <laughs> you play rock, paper, scissors with the team builder? I don't want to play rock, paper, scissors with the team builder. Uh, ugh. I don't, I don't like the UI. No. Forget it. <laughs> Do you have a good day, GI? <laughs> it wants to make sure you're having a good, a good day before you play it. You didn't answer the question! I said neutral! <laughs> I say neutral! Neutral is good enough. Okay. Let me get the reference that I wanted to use. It's really not the prettiest thing. Oh no, it's not. It's not really that pretty. It's not. It really isn't. <laughs> okay. Um. Where is the thing that I wanted to use? Okay. Uh, oh god, I have way too many tabs open. Okay. I uh, need this reference over here. And make it... Smaller. There you go. I think that should work. You can customize showdown, but you have to do it manually, so it's annoying. It, it looks... Very annoying. <laughs> It honestly looks very annoying. It doesn't look like it's gonna be uh, that easy to customize. Actually, I need to make this bigger. So I need a good reference for what I'm gonna do. Hey, it's Saturday. Is this Tiaki the anti Garfield? It's not Saturday. It's Friday. It's Friday. Okay, did I have music for this? It's silent. What is this? Oh. <laughs> I keep forgetting the songs that I have for this. Wait, let me change this. Um. Uh. <laughs> more sad songs. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. I'm trying to find the good song. What is this? That is also sad. I really do have only sad songs here, huh? <laughs> Actually, this is even sadder than the other one. <laughs> Oh no. Okay, what about this one? Are you are you very relaxed? <laughs> I think this is a bit too uh not this. <laughs> oh no. Also, hi hi bam, welcome, welcome. Okay, where is a good song? Sometimes I miss the old side to BGM. Oh yeah, the one with the violin. What about this? Yeah, there you go. That's more like it. <laughs> uh, you need to stop music for team building. It's very serious business. We don't need the depressing music, okay? The perfect BTM to play while being an EP hour. <laughs> but the sad boy hours. We're not having sad boy hours. No. Okay. So I'm trying to replicate this format. We're probably gonna ignore this entire section. Probably just gonna go with... The picture, which is probably gonna make this, this, the six Pokemon, 
And I don't know why there's that many Pokeballs in here. That's a little bit weird. I search for the violin BGM and Dova Syndrome just to listen to it. <laughs> uh, badges? Hmm. Yeah, but the badges kind of like vary from region to region. Yeah, these are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, those are the badges, but since those kind of like vary from region to region. Um, yeah, it's obtained badges. There you go. Hmm. I should probably just stick with picture. Oh boy. About to truly show the graphic design is truly not my passion. <laughs> oh no. Okay. I'm using my mouse right now because um I don't have my my tablet plugged in. So it really is gonna be uh very scuff. Make badges with their mascot. There's only five mascots, though. There's not eight. There's only five. How am I gonna do that? Okay, let's see. Uh, what would be a good... Where's the shape tool? I don't really use the shape tool. That's a selection tool. I think it's... Tool settings. Since I don't really use the shape tool, I often forget what it is. Uh, is there rectangle? There you go. It's a bit too rectangular. Uh, it says it's a very ugly color. Mm. Oh, is YouTube not notifying people? Oh, YouTube is at it again. I feel like it happens more often than not. Maybe just like a white. Maybe grayish? Just so it's visible. You know what? Maybe if I do it over this one, just so I kind of... Hmm. need to make this a little bit smaller. So I can truly fit all of them. And then... I'm gonna make another layer so I can draw the shape over it. Just to kind of get an idea of how big I want to make them. You know, like around here. Okay, get rid of that. Should I put this more to this side? Make it trans... No. This, make it transparent. Okay. <laughs> What's so... up? Hi, hi, Rivison. Welcome, welcome. Honestly, I almost never get notifications for Chiaki. I just always show up anyways. How do you do it? <laughs> How do you do it then? I mean, since you'll be ignoring the middle part, you can make it thinner. Hmm. Oh well, yeah, since I'm ignoring this, I kind of need to... Maybe if I put... There's six. One, two, three. One, two, three. Maybe if I make the squares for the Pokemon a little bit bigger. That could work. That could work. I think the profile picture is a bit too much. Oh, there you go. Uh, can I make it so the corners are not that round? Kind of like... Probably I'm gonna make this a little bit smaller. Profile picture. Not that long. Since probably gonna make it around here. It's gonna be very scuff. <laughs> Is it just put the waiting room on until you jump out of your seat when Tiaki says hi hi out of there? <laughs> That's how you know. <laughs> we look at your upcoming stream time. True. But it's not like you would be checking the waiting rooms all the time though. Or are you? Straight to business today. The jelly incident really changed Kiaki. I was never the same after the jelly incident. Everything changed for me, you know? It's Saturday here. Oh, it's already Saturday. Man. Time zones. Time zones really be crazy. Okay. And I'm probably gonna make the little squares for the Pokemon. Probably like... I should probably do everything on separate layers for my own sanity. How big do I make them? Like this? Hmm. If I duplicate like that, the fact that I'm not naming my layers is gonna come back to bite me. <laughs> oh my god. 
Exactly, since this is a satsuing stream. Sat satsu working thing in the jiggy. Hey, Raps, imagine a Tiaki calendar. A Tiaki calendar? How would that work? Also, hi, hi on the fine. Welcome, welcome. I'm probably like this. Can I fit three? Maybe. Maybe I can make this work. We will see. We'll see how how cursed this goes. <laughs> Already anticipating the consequences of her actions. Always. Always, always. Every day. Oh no, the one million layers. Yes, this is probably gonna come back to bite me once I'm trying to figure out where... what goes where. But for now... Uh, we'll cross that bridge when we get there. <laughs> oh no... We need some intense music! Hmm... What would be a good intense song? I need to... I need to think. I don't... I don't have any intense songs. Every time she draws on the wrong layer? Are you assuming I'm gonna draw on the wrong layer a lot of times? Hmm... Is that what you're thinking? Actually, don't don't listen. Don't listen to Rivison. You you'll probably get intoxicated if you do that. <laughs> uh, don't actually. <laughs> uh, Pokemon gym battle song. Or, I think Pokemon songs might be copyrighted though. The calendar will be your different faces, like your pouting face, Ranger, and Evil Tiaki and Chibiaki. That would actually be a very fun idea. Now that now that you put it into perspective. Basically a death game. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I think these are... Are these lined up? Yes, I think they are lined up. I I think. Either that or I'm seeing things. I think this one is a little... Yes, it's that one. I think they are lined up. I think the more I look at them, the more they throw me off. There's music on YouTube without copyright. The problem with that, it's that sometimes it says it's without copyright, but it's actually not. I actually, like, played those playlists uh, before on... Uh, I think I did it on, like, a Satsu stream, and they got copyright striked anyway. So it's kind of hard to tell which ones of those are actually true. And which ones are not. <laughs> so... It's a... It's a bit... It's a bit hard to tell. There was like this, um... Let me see if I can find it. Heart... What was it? Heart... Soul? God, what was the name of this game? They said they allowed you to play their music on your streams, but... Oh god, I'm forgetting this game. God, what's the name of this game? What's the name of this game? Uh... I'm drawing a blank. Uh, what was the name of it? It's called like Heart Something. Not me trying to look back. <laughs> the medieval-esque game. I don't know if it's... I don't think it's a medieval-esque. Just have a katsu with musical talent create a whole playlist of original music. That is way too much. Heart... Kingdom Hearts is not Kingdom Hearts now. Indie game. <laughs> oh, God. I can't find it. No. No, 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 no. Play Mozart. <laughs> Look at Pokemon remixes. I mean, there's people that still copyright those. It's kind of hard to think. Uh, Jesus, what was the name of this game? Shadow Hearts? No, it's not that game. It's not Shadow Hearts. Oh my god. What was the name of that game? I'm trying to find it, but... Mm, why does everything have copyright now? YouTube is very strict with copyright. Let me see... Rusty Hearts comes to mind. No... Let me see, let me see... Mm, I mean, it has always had copyright. I mean, yeah, it was, they've always been strict about copyright. It's not a new thing. Artbound? Might be that one. Yeah, that's the one. That's the one. Heartbound. 
play. I think they had a play. They had a playlist of music. It's the after effects of the early 2010s when uh, people went viral with parodies. Could be. Could be. Uh, where's the music? OCT. They used to be less strict about it way back when music publishers started cracking down on it. Okay, I could probably I could probably go with this. Let me change this to system settings then. You're gonna hear Windows. Okay, I guess I'll have to change to system settings now. System. I guess you guys can hear the music. I hope it doesn't like go out of out of this playlist. Jesus Christ, that was loud. <laughs> this is so intense, actually. <laughs> this might be a little too intense. Nah, me getting tricked and thinking it's my Windows noises. Yeah, I'm putting a random playlist. Maybe I should have put a different song. <laughs> I put it on shuffle, by the way. <laughs> Makes me feel like we're making a lead for builds. <laughs> hey, server team building has to be intense. Only the most intense of team buildings. Where's my other? Where's the other card? Oh, there it is. It blends in really easily. I need to add the outlines for these. This is the base. I'm gonna need to start naming these layers. Base. This is the profile picture. This is PFB. And, um... All of these I'm gonna name later. <laughs> I'm gonna start putting outlines to these. Just so it doesn't blend in. Probably stick them all in a folder too. Yes. For sure. Stick them on in this folder. There you go. Put all of that in this. Oh, it didn't go into the folder. Okay. This. Put it in the folder. There you go. It's a little better. So we actually need to make the competitive teams to match the music vibes. I don't know if we're really making competitive teams. I, I don't know if we're really doing that. <laughs> yeah, they I put them on the folder, so they're they're grouped. Uh, where's the base? This is the base. What? Oh right, I need to select this entire thing. I'm gonna go outline selection. Draw outside. Uh, and don't need that color though. No. Ah, not this. Deselect. I wanna add a border to this, but I'm also gonna need to move this out of the corner. I wonder what will be Tiaki's competitive team. Kind of hard to tell. I feel this was this song is very similar to the past song we did. Well, uh, where is... Outline selection. I'm trying to select this specific one. Change this to maybe a black? Where did the border go? Did it not... It did not draw it where I wanted it, which was around the thing. <laughs> I didn't realize this is supposed to be a new song. It sounds very similar, yes. What's your favorite type? Mm. Kind of hard for me to pick a favorite type. Border Doku. I don't know why I didn't make the border. What? Oh, is it because it's on a folder? It's gonna select everything. That's annoying. Yeah, I'm gonna shove it out of the folder then. Why is it selecting everything? Ice water for me, really? I like I really like water types though. But kinda hard for me to pick one. Oh now it made it. There you go. It's a bit too thick though. And also not the right color. I wanted it black. Online selection. Tiaki's favorite type is dark, so she's cutie. That's not true. You're making that up. 
I like some dark types, but it's not my favorite type, no. <laughs> oh my god. Also, hi, hi, metal. Welcome, welcome. I need like this. Could work. Yeah, I could probably add something up there. I guess depending what accent colors could work. Okay. Uh, let me see. How can I... I need to get the PNGs. I'll work on the, de on the design of the card later. <laughs> we'll, we'll figure that out when we get there. So... We'll figure that out later. Let me see. I need the PNGs. I'm done. I feel there's way too many Pokemon designs to only have one favorite type. It is! There's way too many. I mean, Suzumi based on the girls better that way. For sure, yeah. For sure. Let's see. Oh! I forgot Nevi's PNG is so big. Wait. Do I have... You know what? I know, I know an easier way. I should probably just save it. I'm so used to just copy and pasting. And I forget Clip, Stu Clip Studio Paint does this thing. When you copy and paste PNGs, they kind of just like uh, give you a black background. Which I don't really appreciate, even if they're PNGs. Okay, fine. Be that way, Clip Studio Paint. Clip Studio Paint. <laughs> Honestly. Okay, fine. I guess I'll have to save the PNGs. I usually just copy and paste. Is adding legendary allowed? No. I feel like adding legendaries is making too overpowered. We're not adding legendaries. We're making Pokemon teams, but without legendaries. I think legendaries is a bit too... I don't know. It's a bit too biased. <laughs> Uh, where did it save? Okay. It keeps saving on random folders. Makes this harder. Also, hi, hi, Kuroko. Welcome, welcome. There you go. Oh, that's not the right thing. What's this? Control V. There you go. There you go. And I need to resize this. Blech. Resize it. And I need to make this. Actually, if I can crop it, that would make it so much easier. Fair enough, but I admit I like adding at least one legendary for VTuber teams, really. We still wait for the black background, so it's so annoying. I and mean, there's some pretty mid legendary Pokemon like Reggie Rock, isn't exactly that strong. I guess, but. I don't know, it doesn't feel like it's very balanced. Ooh. She becomes really pixelated when I shrink her, since her PMG is very high res. This is a pain. Okay, how do I make this work? Do I have a smaller PMG of her? Uh can't lower the resolution. I feel like I'm gonna have to use an external program for that. She doesn't look that pixelated there. I would just have to crop her. Probably around here. Be good. No, right? Copy. Paste. Doing this the old style way. Okay, there you go. Problem solved. <laughs> Easy. Okay. Now, where is the... Here's the profile picture thingy. And now we proceed... The shrinking. Dun, 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 bum, 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 bum. It's a work in progress. I need to shrink her even more. I like this would work. Oh my god, he's so pixelated. <laughs> oh no. Oh, you can I can see the pixels in here. 
Truly living up to the name, I would say. <laughs> oh no. This is way too pixelated. <laughs> Turned into pixel art. It really did. I mean, if you look at it from so far away, it doesn't it doesn't look that bad. <laughs> it doesn't look that pixelated. Okay, maybe. I really need to lower the resolution somehow. Hmm, pixel levy, pixel levu. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's gonna be hmm. Far away and crunching the eyes a lot. Yeah, it looks way better. <laughs> if I put it like this. And I'm just gonna have to delete a lot to make her fit in there. Actually, I think it might be deleting a bit too much just to make it work. So I do need to just shrink her. Yeah, it's a bit too much deleting. Hmm. It's uh, not as pixelated as the Pokemon games. Yeah, it's too much. Too much shrinking that I'm gonna have to do. Low res it is. I'm trying not to, like, shrink her too much. But I feel I'm just gonna have to. See, it doesn't look that bad unless you zoom in. <laughs> uh, do an Uno Reverence and spam the whole template? I don't want to make the templates too big because I'm I'm trying to fit everyone's templates in here. It doesn't look that bad at a normal distance, which would be like around here. Like if you start zooming in, like at a hundred percent zoom, it doesn't look too bad actually. It's only when you start zooming in. Which, uh, that, that's when we start having issues. Okay, now I'm gonna need to... I really should have plugged in my tablet. This is not very optimal. That I'm just doing this with my mouse, but... This is fine. <laughs> oh no. If you zoom in, it has too much pixels. Which is why you don't zoom in. That's exactly precisely why. As soon as you can change the image resolution with the edit menu. Uh, uh, fine. <laughs> edit. Uh, outline. Change image resolution. Okay. What would be a good resolution? We need to... I'm gonna make her 72 DPI. Ooh, that just made the entire canvas 72 DPI. I do not appreciate that. No, never mind. I take it back. Even though I was selecting her layer, it just made my entire canvas 72 DPI. <laughs> oh no, you know what? Forget it. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go with the method I was doing. <laughs> yeah, it does the whole work area. That is that is bad. Even though I was on Nebius's layer. Uh... Yeah, never mind. This is not gonna work. <laughs> we're just gonna have to do what we were doing before. That's just what we're gonna have to do. It's probably gonna be the same case for all the girls. But we're living up to our name of being pixelated, so it's fine. It's very on brand. <laughs> Okay. At a hundred percent? Yeah, it looks fine at a hundred percent. Okay. It's honestly not that bad. Now to go back to my job of deleting this. The pixelation is a feature. Exactly, it's a feature. It's just part of the deal, you know? Okay. She thinks we won't zoom in! Don't you dare zoom in! <laughs> a link board for being horrendously pixelated. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> okay. Uh, I think this is where. There you go. Kind of like that. Yes. Like this. Very nice. Bum, ba -da -ba -bum, ba -da -ba -bum. But if we add the pixelation to the pixelated pi picture, it's gonna I feel it's gonna look worse. 
I feel like we do that, it's really just not gonna look good. Oh. No, not that. It's gonna look really bad, actually. Uh, please excuse the fact that I'm doing this with my mouse. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, there's chopping this. The pigtails off. I'm cleaning this. There you go. Oh, I erased that a little too much. Wow. Just like that. <laughs> On a scale, wait to see how bad the pixels are for the Pokemon images since it's even smaller. Oh, God. Don't jinx it. <laughs> Please don't jinx it. I'm probably gonna look for, like, the sprites. I feel if I look for sprites, it's gonna be easier. Rather than the Pokemon itself. Either that, or I might cheese it by using mystery dungeon pictures, depending on the Pokemon. If we if we do Scarlet and Violet, then I'm so doomed, because there's no mystery dungeon pictures for that. <laughs> but, um, also Sword and Shield doesn't have mystery dungeon profiles. But a lot of others do, therefore, I can get away with it. It looks so weird that her halo is cut off like this, but... I do not have a PNG that doesn't have a halo. So, we're rolling with it. We are just rolling with it. So I need to chop the horns and the... Hoge. Dun 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 dun. Pokemon sprites should be easy. Yeah, Pokemon sprites should be easy, I feel. If you can't find sprites, I'm pretty sure Surabi has the sprites images PNG. Hmm, yeah, I believe Surabi should have them, yeah. Where's Chiaki? Wait, no, Ahoga! Yes, the Ahoga has been chopped. It's gone now. <laughs> has been chopped for the picture. There you go. Not a bad job if I say so myself. Bada beam, bada boom. This program like is like by color. Can you select the gray box, invert, then erase? It's sure to allow you to select by per, uh, by color. Yeah, well, not by color, but do an invert select. Yeah, I could have cleaned it by doing that, but I made it the hard way because <laughs> I I make things more difficult for myself. <laughs> oh man, oh man. Okay, there you go. Now, the ears too! Her ears are still there! Annabi's your Debbie. She's still there! Her ears are still here! You can see them! Right there! <laughs> okay. Now, for the team! I'm gonna write some notes on the side that I'm gonna delete later. But these notes are just for me. Uh, based on design. Um... Uh, I'm gonna put this on a separate layer. I see it! Uh, my god, my Navis's team. Uh, my pulse is not good. Please excuse this. <laughs> I would see maybe it could be a fairy. Be maybe a fairy type? Could be maybe psychic? Uh, blah blah blah. Psychic. <laughs> There's no text to it. Yes, there is. <laughs> there is a text tool, but I'm gonna delete these anyway. And having to use a text tool would be much more of a pain. So... You, you would just have to deal with my bad, um, mouse pulls. <laughs> there you go, psychic. Okay, yeah, psychic, um... What other types could it be? Maybe dark? There is purple, and dark types tend to have lots of purple. So... Another possibility could be... Dark? Poison? Maybe. I'll put question marks on both dark and poison. On the possibilities. To see what we're looking at here. Dark and poison. An electric? I wouldn't say Nebby with electric, nah. This is really a really fit color scheme. I guess dark because of deep dark space. Maybe steel. Got a lot of white and gray. 
I would say steel could work. I would say maybe more than poison, actually. She doesn't have that much purple, so... I'll put steel. Okay. So... Usually this spot is kind of like your starter. We're not sticking strictly to starter Pokemon. But... Let me see. I, I low-key feel that, um... Reuniclas or Solaces or one of those, I think that could actually fit. Starter would be difficult. For starter, it's pretty much just your main Pokemon. We're not picking necessarily like Pokemon starters specifically. We're pretty much any 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 Pokemon. That it will be her main one, you know? Kinda like your traveling companion. Pepe should be based more on character than color scheme. I guess character... It's more on theme. Like, galaxy... We're basing it a lot on, like, her themes and her color scheme. But yeah... Reuniclus, uh, this one. I don't know why when I see Navi, I kind of think Reuniclus would work. Where did it go? Oh, it's right there. Uh... Mm, Malamar? I mean, it has tentacles, so like, maybe? Yeah, I, I see Ruinicolas with her. The opposite is her theme, but you don't want to include legendaries. Yeah, I don't... I, we're not really putting legendaries. Yeah, Soul Rock or Lunatone? Is there any other galaxy-themed? Alien Pokemon? Maybe Galaxy Space. Oh, there's uh, the, the, the... But it's also legendary Cosmog. Uh, Cosmog is technically a legendary. Uh, Jirachi, that's also legendary. Yeah, I feel like a lot of galaxy theme mods are legendary. Yeah, that's kind of the issue. <laughs> a lot of galaxy are uh are legendary. Was Genesis special? Yeah. Allegian is an alien. True, Allegian. Ultra V is the same case with legendaries. Well, Ellie Gem is kind of cute. I think Ellie Gem could work. So, ignore the fact that it has this ugly background. These are just ideas. These are not the final images. These are just ideas. Hmm, something. Clef Clefairy is tied to the moon, isn't it? True. Isn't Clefairy tied to the moon? I think Clefairy could be good. True. So, I'll, I'll add Clefairy. I think Clefairy is cute. True, yeah. Clefairy has, like, ties to the moon. So, that's three. Okay. There you go. We got these three. Clefairy depends on moon since for evolution. It is tied to the moon. Yes. It is tied to the moon. You can Cosmog as a legendary. I feel like Cosmog is a legendary. Yeah. Is it's one of those Pokemon you can only get one of. So I I wouldn't really put Cosmog. Metang or Beldum? Metang or Beldum? I'm gonna say Steel types. There's our Beetle, which is a UFO bug Pokemon, but Debbie hates bugs. Mm, yeah, then there are no bug types then. And it mostly to the two legendaries of that Gen 2, right? Yes. I'm looking at Steel types, but none of them really... I'm not fully fitter, I feel. Hey, look like you can get two Cosmogs. <laughs> Still, no. Cosmog, Cosmog is out of the question now. I'm trying to see if there's any Steel types. Um, I don't... None of the Steel types kind of like convince me. Because she's not really, like, mechanical-themed, necessarily. Agonism kind of looks like a UFO. Togepi isn't legend. No, Togepi's not legendary, no. Lunatone and Soul Rock. Maybe Lunatone could work? Lunatone. Hmm. I mean, it is kind of related to space. Our technicals are technically mechanical, but not metallic. Yeah, that's kind of like the thing. They're not metallic. Tinkaton is the closest steel fairy, but no space themes. Yeah, it's kind of like not really... 
related. Honich? She doesn't really have a medieval setting, though. Like, I feel she's very cyberpunk-y type of theme. So it wouldn't really go with Honech. Honech, if it was like a more medieval style, then maybe, but... Umbrian has a moon theme. Umbrian's color scheme is too dark. I don't... Mm. I feel like Umbrian's color scheme might be too dark. Not fully fitting. I'll put Lunatone as a maybe. Well, I'll add Lunatone as a big maybe. Not fully convinced on Lunatone, but... I'll add it as a maybe. It's a possibility. Okay, shrink. It's just a maybe. Maybe, maybe. You'll find an Eevee evolution that fits. Mm, I mean, the closest I can see is maybe Sylveon, but not fully, really. Sun theme instead, but the color scheme kind of works. The color scheme works better, yeah. Star maze part psychic and it's a star. Mm, very psychic dark types. Are there any dark types that are not too... Too black or purple? Dark type... Mm, I'm looking at all the dark types right now. Oh, wait, this guy. Uh, what's her name? What's his face? Uh, God, I'm, I'm drawing a blank. <laughs> uh, the pre-evolution of Malamar. I kind of want to have that one as her starter. I think it's really cute. And I think it kind of works. It kind of reminds me a little bit of a Neveling. Uh, God, what's his name? NK. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. NK. I think that will be cute as her starter. Starter is main Pokemon. Not necessarily like actual starter, since this is not a starter Pokemon. I think is very cute. Reminds me a little bit of a Nubbling. Okay. Inkay. Let's see, let's see. Not bad. Very cute. Yeah, Inkay is very cute. I think it's really cute. I could see that, yeah. I thought about Minior, but turns out it's Rock Flying. Yeah, I don't think Minior fully works. I mean, is what is Minior supposed to be? Is it is it a meteorite? What is Minior supposed to be? Uh I mean it could work actually. Loki actually could have worked. Actually, yeah, I think Minior could work. A meteor is a meteor, yes. A mini meteor. Oh yeah, I think that one could be cute. This one. Go with specifically this specific one. The meteor Pokemon. Okay. Magnazone, a UFO. Is Magnazone supposed to be a UFO? Okay, I have one, two, three, four, five, six. Luna told I'm the one that I'm most unsure about, to be fair. Uh, Luna told I'm not fully in. Not really, but it kind of looks like one. <laughs> mm, I'm not fully sold on Luna Town. Magnuson is a UFO. I, mean, I guess Magnuson could work. Apparently, Gotharita is believed to be from space. I feel like Gotharita's design is way more like Gothic style. So I'm not fully like. Feel like it would have fit. Well, what would you say it's supposed to be a UFO? Wait, Magnuson? Interesting. I didn't know it was. It, I mean, I guess you could kind of see it. Space, space god. <laughs> I feel it's like too gothic style to truly fit. But if if there was like a more gothic style VTuber, maybe. But with her current. Like, Gotharitas or Gothitels, I feel it's too... My goodness, a song. <laughs> I feel it's too goth. It's too goth for this theming. I think I... I think Magnezone is actually kind of cool. Magnezone. Three units generate Magnezone. There have been mistakenly reports of beautiful sightings that Magnezone flies through the night sky. 
They're supposed to be magnets, but it, I guess it kind of looks like a UFO. A little bit, I guess. Could be, could be. Okay. I might change Elijam, because I think Elijam is also psychic. And uh, since we're not making them specifically one type, I think having a variety of typings could be good. Like, ju not just one type. Uh, yeah, I believe Ellie Gem is psychic, if I remember correctly. Ellie Gem? Psychic, yeah. A lot of psychic types right now. Yeah, Clefairy is fairy. Is it normal fairy now? Clefairy types. Clefairy is a fairy type. Fairy Clefairy is now fairy. Clefairy is fairy, Reuniclus is psychic. I don't, I don't remember if Reuniclus is any other type. Lunatone is rock. I... Yeah, Lunatone is rock psychic. Uh, yeah, secondary type psychic. Um, NK is dark. NK type? Is she dark? NK. Dark psychic. Yeah, we have a lot of psychics. Uh, honestly, just getting rid of Ellie Gem, since that one's pure psychic. And I'm gonna replace it for Magna Zone. I need a good picture. A lot of psychic. Reuniclus is psychic only. Yeah, Reuniclus is psychic only, but so is Elidrum. So that's why I'm gonna get rid of Elidrum. Uh, which one are you? I think it's this one. Yeah, it's that one. Remove. Just to kind of give myself an idea of what the team is, and then pretty much get proper images for them. I'm gonna put it like that. Okay, now to actually look for the proper images. <laughs> oh, did not delete this. I thought I did. There you go. Now. I mean, no, Reuniclus is too pixelated. Let me look at Cerebi. I think Cerebi has this good... Pixel... Um, pixel sprites. Cerebi. Cerebi, 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 Cerebi. Gigantamax or Beetle is also UFO looking. Yeah, but um Nevi expressed that she doesn't really like bugs. That's kinda like why we're not putting Orbeetle there. Okay. Let me see. Yeah. Is that someone also mentioned uh Orbeetle, but yeah. Let's see. Good sprite. I need one for Reuniclus. Let's see, Reuniclus. Right hole also kind of looks like a UFO and also has tentacles. Mm. I guess... I don't know which one we would change. Maybe Lunatone since it's too much Psychic. Like Psychic has a second type in Psychic. NK is Dark Psychic. It's too many Psychic types, but they're kind of like the ones that fit the most funny enough. Might get rid of Lunatown. Maybe for Ferret Horn. Mm, is this a sprite? Let me see. Trying to find where do they keep the sprites. But... Picture. Open image and new tab. Okay, this one. It's not a PNG. P PNG. Uh, why do you do this to me? Do you like him wrong? Uh, is that spacing by change space on the sky? Eh, I feel it's a little too unrelated. I feel like and rock might be a little too unrelated. Uh, you can always remove background later. I guess, yeah. Um, what this? Which one is this? Oh, now this is the part where I struggle to figure out which square is which. Not not on here, though. Seems... Where would I put Reuniclus? Uh, maybe her fourth Pokemon? Maybe fourth. This is... Yeah, this is space number four, so... 
Number four. Okay. It's looking very pixelated right now. We're just gonna be the ace of the team. Might be Clefairy? <laughs> I know NK's gonna be starter. I don't know Clefairy... I mean, I feel Clefairy's gonna be very support. Very support based. I don't think any of them can sweep. Honestly. <laughs> I don't think any of these... I don't, maybe Ryoniklas might be a psychic sweeper? I'm not sure. I've never used Ryoniklas, so I'm not sure if, if you can actually make your Ryoniklas be a sweeper, like a special attack sweeper. So maybe Ryoniklas. I think it's more of a tan? A genuine question, but doesn't matter where the Pokemon is placed. Is it symbolic? Ah, uh, usually... I think people usually place their supports on the back. Usually sweepers, I believe they go out the front? Ryoniklas is good at sweeping. He can set up a trick room and go crazy. Okay, then I guess that can be the sweeper. <laughs> I can be... I think... I guess Ryoniklas can be a sweeper. Because I wasn't entirely sure. Um... If I could set it up as a sweeper, since I've never really used it. Let me see. Oh, it looks very crisp. <laughs> oh no, look at that. Look at those pixels. And then the sweepers either go back or forward. I guess it varies, yeah. That out. <laughs> I need an actual PNG. This is not a real PNG. <laughs> oh no. Sarah B lied to me. I thought this would be a good crisp. Um Okay. Uh Reuniclus Sprite. <laughs> okay, we need a Oh wait, I can use the black and white ones. True. Since Reuniclus is Gen 5. Let's go. We can still save this one. And this can still be saved. Okay, okay. There's hope, there's hope. Okay, this one's small enough, so... <gasps> yes! Let's go, let's go, let's go. I can make this work. I can actually make this work. <laughs> okay, it's not, it's not fully over. Oh, what is that? This is number four. Now, I just need to... Select... Select. First appearance is Gen 5. Yeah, luckily since it's a Gen 5, it won't be as hard. Oh, great. Uh, turn this off. There you go. What is this pixel? Why isn't selecting it properly? No, fuck that. There you go. And turn this on. And now we start deleting. Oh, uh, invert. Now, there you go. Now I can actually make this far cleaner than what I did before. There you go. You got your unique list in there. Might not be able to use this fight for Minior and in cases that were both Gen 6 and 7. Unfortunately, yes. <laughs> Unfortunately, you are right. We are not going to be able to do that. <laughs> because these are Gen 6 and 7. And that's when they stop making uh, pixelated sprites. So, we might be in a bit of a pickle once we get there. <laughs> yeah, it was a switch to 3D. Therefore, no more pixels, right? This might be a bit of a pickle. Also, I noticed that the music just stopped. Where's the thing? Where did my playlist go? It's just gone. I think it's somehow just closed. And I have, not, I have no idea where it went. That's not good. Now we're in silence. Where is the thing? Uh, into the void we go. Into the void we go, indeed. Let's see. Uh, Where's the thing? Autoplay shenanigans? I think it just closed it entirely. Which I'm struggling to find. They are in pixels, but Gen 7 and 9 still has sprites that can work, if I recall correctly. Mm, I guess we might still be able to make it work. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. Um, I lost a thing. Where's my thing? Uh, Jesus Christ. I can't find the playlist. <laughs> oh, no. I don't know where it went. Let me 
Shit. Where did it go? I can't find it. I think I lost it. Back to the sad music? I don't want to play the sad music. No, I don't want to play it. I'm trying to find the thing. Let me your YouTube history. It just disappeared, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can find it again. Let me see. I don't know why it got closed. It just suddenly got closed with no warning whatsoever. Okay. There you go. Okay. There you go. There you go. I found the playlist. <laughs> there you go. Okay, now back to what I was doing. Uh, looking for proper sprites. <laughs> okay. You guys have any preference on the placement? I'm obviously putting in K at first, um, but the other uh, team members. I don't know if you guys have any preference on where you want the others to be. Actually, I should probably look for NK first. So that's the one I know where we're placing. NK. Let me see. NK sprite. Can I find a good sprite for NK? I feel like A should be last, and that's how it's usually it's in the games. Really? We evolved Inky into Malamar. No one's to really earth in her lore. Malamar's text mention has shaped history. But I want to keep NK as the main. I want to keep it as baby. I feel Malamar looks... Uh, uh, mm, not too big on Malamar's design. I feel like it fits less with Nevi. So I, I want to keep NK as, uh, as baby. I feel it fits better with her. Yeah, there are too many 3D models. Ooh, I found one for NK. I think it's a fan made, but we're gonna go with it. <laughs> it's pixelated. Let's go. <laughs> it's a webby! How could you do this to me? Yeah, Mal Malabar looks a bit too sinister. That's what I'm thinking. <laughs> oh man. The fan made ones are pretty good. Yeah, it, it, this one looks pretty good. The problem is, is. And, uh, it's a, 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 uh, Weppy. Fan-made sprites, my beloved. Yeah, because this was already, like, the, the 3D. How could you do this to me? Weppy to PNG. And now I'm gonna have to turn this, uh, copy image link. Can I just copy the link without actually having to save the web tree? Oh, there it is. Enter image URL. Give it to me. Give me the PNG. Okay. Okay, let's see. Okay, I got it. Where did it go? Oh, there it is. Gonna put this on... Flip. There you go, it's a little guy. This is a fan-made sprite. Oh my goodness, what is this? Uh, diesel. It's just a little guy. <laughs> if you change the extension .webby to .jpg, uh, while down when downloading it, it should work as normal, really? But it doesn't allow you to change the extension when you're downloading it. Okay, there it is. It's a little guy. It's a little guy. I think it looks really cute. I really like how that looks. Okay, I'm gonna remove the ones that I already used, so... Probably rem remove my notes. I don't really need these anymore. Uh, we already used Runiqua's, so we'll delete. Not Clefairy yet, nor Lunatown. I did already add NK. Delete. I just like save as or something equivalent. It doesn't ask you where to save. It asks me where to save, but it doesn't allow me to change the file type. No. Let's see, then I need a mini or. mini or sprite. I want to get the pink one, though. I don't want to get the the, uh, the normal one. There's a blue one. Where's the pink one? 
Mini or Sprite? Pink. No, no one made an actual Sprite of the pink one. This is illegal. They made one, but it's animated. <laughs> oh, no. This is... I'm officially in shambles right now. Yeah, they only made an animated one. Yeah, someone made one. and Someone made a fan one. But it's an animated one. Can I actually make this work some shape or form? It's a GIF. Of course it is. It doesn't allow me to turn it into anything other than a GIF. Ah. This is... Officially in shambles. Okay, how do I make this work? I could just take the normal sprites, but it's gonna look really weird. Because I'm taking it from the Pokédex, it's not gonna give me, um... Pixelated. I don't think it supports gifts, no, unfortunately. Are you planning for a Pokemon game? Not really, no. We're kind of just making uh, Pokemon teams, just for the fun of it. I need a red core one. They're called, it's called Minior Red Core. Minior Red Core. Sprite, please. Hmm, I'm not getting the pixel sprites. Yeah, we're just making teams, yeah. It'd be better to use a trainer card maker. Nah, because they include a lot of information that we're not really gonna use. So it would just look weirdly empty. Hence why I had to make a custom one. Mirror Fairy Call has like three to four colors. Uh, depending on the core one that you get, yeah. Fake PNG. I dislike it very much. How could you do this to me? Minior. Yeah, I'm just gonna have to stick to not making all of them pixelated. Because some of them just don't have pixel spreads. So it's not gonna happen. <laughs> okay, Minior. Okay, copy paste. It's a fake one! I literally got it from the Pokemon website. I'm about to throw hands. Okay, there you go. <laughs> oh no, okay. Where do I put you? Um maybe second or third? Maybe second. Yeah, any Pokemon Plus Black and White is gonna be a toss-up if someone made a pixel sprite. Yeah, pretty much. The official one using fake PNG. <laughs> then here's another sweeper, by the way. Oh, really? Mm. I could put it at the last. Kind of like a last special sweeper, maybe. Just the last. Yes. Could center it a bit more. Kind of like here. Yes, kind of like that. I got this. Oh, turn this off. There you go. And then turn on Minior. And then invert. And then start deleting. Dun, 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 dun. There you go. Just like that. He's right there. Her final card to destroy her foes. Yes, gonna have the little mini at the end. Super imposing. Look at those menacing eyes. This is the last thing you see before you get defeated. Their sense looks more imposing. I mean, usually some people leave their last uh, attackers at the end. He's more of a physical attacker. He uses Shell Smash to boost his speed and attack a bunch. Mm, so he's more physical. Interesting. I mean, he is a rock type, so I guess it makes sense. I, f I feel rock types are definitely more physical. They're either defensive or physical attackers. Makes a lot of sense, actually. I can see it. This is slot number six. Okay. I guess physical makes sense. He's a meteor, so imagine him crashing into you. Yeah, makes makes sense. Makes sense. Then where? Which one is this? Oh, there you go. And delete layer. And we have. 
Magnuson Clefairy and Lunatone. Does look quite physical, the design. Yeah, he's a meteor, so it makes sense. It actually adds up. It's not only because he has no good special flying attacks, otherwise he could run either way. I'm assuming it probably cannot learn Brave Bird. Which, you know, makes sense. It's not a bird. <laughs> okay. I can probably get a good Clefairy sprite since Clefairy is like Gen 1. So there's probably a variety of Clefairy sprites I can take of. Oh my god, what is that? That is not a Clefairy sprite. That's a that's a scary creature. <laughs> that's just not what I was looking at. Wait, here you go. I found a I found a a bad weapon. That's what I found. <laughs> no, Clefairy sleep demon. Yes, I don't I don't think I, I should show this. It's too scary. Spooky Clefairy, are you sure you want to see it? I don't think you will... You'll ever be able to see Clefairy the same way ever again after this one. Show it, we're brave! Okay. You were warned. Don't say I didn't warn you. Oh, it's being covered. You guys are lucky. <laughs> what does it look like that? What is it? <laughs> Oh my god. It's so cursed. Yeah. Look that cookie cutter shark this fine. He's just a little guy. <laughs> oh, he's so derpy. It's a Pokemon fusion. Yeah, it showed up when I looked up Clefairy. Yeah, for whatever reason. <laughs> What's that? What do you show us that monstrosity? <laughs> yeah, it showed up when I was looking for Clefairy sprites. Yeah, I think it's from Pokemon Fusion. Oh, but yeah, I was like, what is that? <laughs> that doesn't look like the Clefairy that I know. But it the curious Garfield pics. Make truly makes you wonder what type of Garfield pictures that you look at. Pokemon Fusion game is great, not gonna lie. I've heard a lot of people really, really liked it. I wonder what it was fused with. Maybe Sand Shrew because of the skin? Could be Sand Shrew. What if Yushin has some amazingly cursed sprites? Look up so. Oh, I know Mr. Mime. I am unfortunately acquainted with Mr. Mime. I really wish I wasn't, actually. <laughs> I have seen Mr. Mime. <laughs> oh, if it was up to me, I would much rather not have seen Mr. Mime. Lived a blissfully unaware existence of Mr. Mine. Mr. Mine PTSD, yeah. The Mr. The Mr. Mime and Pincer one, it's so bad. I hate it. <laughs> it's called like Mr. Sir or something. Like the Mr. Sir one, it looks like something straight out of a horror movie. Anything that you fuse with Mr. Mime is is meant to just be bad. Yeah, Mr. Sir is terrible. I hate it. <laughs> I hate Mr. Sir. I have a special hatred for Mr. Sir. I don't like Mr. Sir. <laughs> I don't know why that was created, but it should have not. <laughs> the only thing I, I can say is like, why would you do this? Why would you bring this thing? Fourth. Okay, that's the fourth one. Where's the third one? Where where is this tile? There's that one. There's the tile. There's that one. You're so out of order. What is this? I'm trying to find oh there it is. It's over here. Why is this one all the way over there? This is profile picture. This is number one. Where's Inke? Should we put Inke over here? This one is number four, yeah. This one is number two. So this one should go here. And where's Clefairy? Clefairy? That's not, it's not Clefairy. That's Minior. 
think I put the Clefairy on. This is what I get for not numbering my layers. That's the space where Clefairy is. Okay, there it is. Just gotta put this one here. Yes, and I'm gonna rename this to number two. <laughs> oh no. I'm already getting lost? Yeah, this was pretty much just brought upon myself because I didn't name my layers. Let this serve as a lesson that you should always name your layers. <laughs> don't do as I do. Don't, don't do that. You're not gonna remember what your layers are. <laughs> so just actually name your layers. Okay, there you go. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, I can take your own lessons! Yeah. <laughs> I probably should take my own lessons. It looks too big. I feel like I need to shrink it more. Okay. Yeah, I think this cliff fairy is a little too big. <sighs> okay, cliff fairy. There you go. Imagine learning for the mistakes of others. Could it be me? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> there you go. Clefairy. Okay, we got we got Clefairy. Oh, Magnazone. I hmm. Just put Lunatone in here. I honestly want to get rid of Lunatone. I feel Lunatone is like too much rock psychic. We already have too much psychic. So I feel like I'm gonna get rid of Lunatone. Might just change it for Ferret Horn, like someone said. Not naming can save time unless you're using too many layers. I am using too many layers. Therefore, I should actually name things. YouTube is buffering. Now I remember why I don't really um, use YouTube for music on stream and I just have that one song. <laughs> okay. Okay, Clefairy, you can disappear. Three psychic and two rock types right now, so we could get rid of Lunatone and get more type diversity. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Get more type diversity. Yeah, the extra bandwidth the YouTube needs. Yeah. It just buffers at random points. I guess Fire Red Horn could work. Okay, we're gonna put a Fire Red Horn. Gonna put that here. And then, Ferratorn. Toss that in there. Put it there. That's not Ferratorn. Copy. There you go. There you go. I'm gonna put this guy... Where do I put you? Also, I should post this. And mini or two. And that tiny NK too. And that reunique list. There you go. In this Rabu drawing programs crashing or not loading. Fredhorn does add grass type, even if it's a second steel. So it's a good replacement. True, true. Where should we put him? Should we put him on third slot or should we put him on the fifth slot? Hmm. Um, hmm. Honestly debating on where should we put him. Where should he go? It's quite a cool saucer ship like design. Yeah. So I think it works. It works. It's a huge tank, if I recall correctly. These tanks, so wherever tanks go, uh, we put him on fifth or third. First line is looking very soft. True. Maybe on third. Since this is like a very soft. We'll have you have in both sides. <laughs> yeah, we'll just put it on third. I think third works. Okay, which is my third? It's fifth. Okay, third slot is all the way here. So we'll rename this to number three. A middle... Uh, a middle tank Pokemon sounds nice. Ah! I moved the slot. That's not what it was supposed to happen. Where is Ferret Horn? Ferret Horn. Which layer is Ferret Horn? Minior. That's a slot. What? Where are you? Oh, there you are. That should be on third slot. Right here. And now, the shrinking begins. Maybe... like this. Not too... shrunken. Put it like this. There you go! I should do it. And now, we select... 
Just uh, turn off this layer. Select square. Then turn it back on. Invert. There you go. So if I hear Tiaki call him Ferrator. <laughs> it's Ferrohor. Wait. It's called Ferrothorn, though. What do you mean? <laughs> That's his name. Ferrothorn is his name. Fer Ferrothorn. Close enough. <laughs> Ferrothorn. It's all together, though. <laughs> Ferro Iron Thorn Thorn. <laughs> Close enough. Ferrothorn. Since it's all together, it's kind of hard to like divide it. It's a bit too. You know what I mean. You know you know what I'm trying to say. Ferrothorn. <laughs> oh, Ferrothorn sounds so cooler. <laughs> oh my god. There you go. There you go. That's team. Pokemon names are kinda tricky, it's fine. <laughs> Alright, from now on I'm calling it Ferrothorn. <laughs> oh no, not like this. Okay, now I'm gonna get rid of not you. You. Delete. Okay, Magnezone. I guess Magnezone will be your last one. All you need to do is refuse to admit you're pronouncing it wrong. The way you say it is the right way. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, Magnezone. And now, for the last member. So when I capture mine, I'll be renaming it Ferritorn. Oh no. <laughs> Gaslight gatekeep girl boss. Oh no. Truly an oh no type of moment. Okay. Then... That's not the right Pokemon. Poppy. Paste. There you go. Magnezone. And we shrink. Probably around here would be good. And then, where is the number 5th slot? This is number 5. So, Reuniclus needs to be here. Is this Reuniclus? No, that's not Reuniclus. Where's Reuniclus? That's Minior. Which slot is Reuniclus? Buffery. That's Ferratorn. Where is Reuniclus? What? It's pretty in line with Pokemon YouTubers to mispronounce Dave anyways, bruh. <laughs> that doesn't really help. Stop, where did I put it? Control click to find someone. Stone select. That's that's not the one I've been looking for. Deselect. I can't find it though. Control. I'm not really finding it, though. Uh, this is... Oh, it's Navi. No. It has to be between this folder. Tiagi pronouncing Pokemon names? No. I don't appreciate that very much. I'm really just gonna have to click one by one. Oh, it's this one. Why did I name it number five? Why did I actually just name Rionicla as number 5? I messed myself up. Rionicla. There you go. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> I can't believe I pretty much just set myself up like that. There you go. Even when the naming gets herself confused, yeah. I realized what the what the problem was. Okay, there you go. At least it will go so much smoother <laughs> um, after this one. This is like the test run, you know. It's... After that, it will be so much smoother because I won't have to struggle with the layout. I would just copy the layout and at the end I'll like customize it so it doesn't look as basic as it does. <laughs> okay. Peace. Oh, not that. Even if they're official, using your Twitter as a test run. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, turn this off. Go with that. Okay, then... Invert. There you go. 
We gotta pick up the pace or we're gonna be here literally all night. Yeah, we're gonna be here all night. <laughs> but that's how it is with these things. Uh, there's always, um, the first one is the most scuff one. Then everything else is far smoother. There you go. Okay. Um, details of the cards are gonna come at the end. Like, make them all pretty and stuff. Right now, they're gonna look basic. <laughs> we gotta look all basic and not cool, but we're... We're gonna... We're gonna... We're gonna fix them up later. <laughs> uh, after that, they're gonna look, uh, hopefully decent. But right now, they're gonna look ugly, so... Uh, I look forward to his next, but it's time to go eat dinner. See you guys later. Bye-bye, Mateo. Hope that you enjoy your dinner. Hope that your dinner is nice. Okay, Magnezone, delete. And I'm gonna name this... It's gonna be the... Nepi... Nepi team. There you go. Nice. And then I'm just gonna dupe this. And gonna... Oh. That did not work out as... Ugh, I didn't put the base! Oh, I didn't put the base in the same folder. Ha 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 ha. My bad. <laughs> okay, now I can duplicate it just fine. Now that the base is in there. Oh, that was the complaint. It was just the steam <laughs> rock thing. Okay, see? Wow. So smooth. So professional. <laughs> okay, there you go. Wow. Almost as if nothing ever happened. Can you believe that? Okay. Now that we got our second template. Oh my, almost like magic. It's truly magic. Can you believe that? <laughs> Very nicely done. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> I am here every... Almost every day, actually. <laughs> I was gonna say, like, what they say on the... On those, like, uh, shows where they're like, I'm here every Wednesday. <laughs> but in reality, I'm here almost every day. Now that I... Now that I actually put it into perspective. Mm -mm -mm. We know it all comes to using templates in the end. She'll be here all week. <laughs> oh no. I'll be here all week. I'll be here all week. Okay. Let me see. Who shall be next? Uh, I guess if we go by debut. Thank you, thank you. I'll be here a week. And the week after? And the week after that one? <laughs> oh no. Okay, uh, I guess Rocky, since she... I usually, for these things, I try to go by debut order. Uh, probably because that makes me last, and that makes me, you know, I feel I feel weird doing myself first. So, I do everyone else before me, because it feels really weird to do myself first. <laughs> so, I just go by debut order. <laughs> okay, let me get a good picture of Rocky. So, hi, hi, Liz. Welcome, welcome. It just feels weird doing myself first, man. Jackie likes to say the best for last. Not really because of that, more of the fact that it just feels weird putting myself first. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, where is the thing? The classic debut order. Yeah, it's just, it's just like way easier to just do a debut order. It's probably already her team and mine. <laughs> I don't know about that one, Chief. <laughs> I mean, you are the leader after all. I guess. It sounds really weird to say, like, Ch I know. Like, no, I, I don't... I don't uh, it sounds weird for me to say that. Okay. That's not... That's not the right thing. Where's the... Did I not save? Ooh, this is so scuffed. Where did it save? It did save! Jackie wants us to anticipate hers more. <laughs> no, not necessarily. Is that an ode out to how awesome you are? Eh. Okay. It's gonna... I feel it's gonna be the same issue as I had with Nevi. That she's gonna look very pixelated. Okay. Now. Okay, we're gonna see how I do this. Wait, where did her teeth go? Anyway. Uh... Okay. So, kind of like this. Time to turn around and do a bunch of pixels. We're all gonna be pixels by the end of this one. Okay. There you go. 
and then copy. Did it not copy? Oh, I think it did. Diesel it. And then just move. There you go. And then delete this. And then we go to this one. This is gonna be crafty. There you go. I feel like team will be psychic with fairies. Really? Another psychic user? I feel like more like dark type. <laughs> I'm feeling more dark types could work. Hatterini was one of that I had in mind. Hatterini's like the big one I had in mind. I feel like I have to make her partner six again. I feel like I have to, Loki. But I I kinda like the other six again. Like the what's it called? I think it's the Alola one. Is it was it Alola? Yeah, the Galler, Galler. Uh, yeah. I saw her favorite focus before. Six Sigurd was not one of them, really. I feel like Six Sigurd would work so well for her though, especially the Galler one. Yeah. Did she mention what her favorite Pokemon were? <laughs> she loves Mimikyu. I could actually see Mimikyu working. I could actually see it. But Galler... Such lost potential with Galler. Okay. But I res I respect... I respect the wishes. Okay. Now our six second is dark. It kind of reminds me because she likes metal. And I feel Galler six second would do metal with her. Which is why I kind of like... I, I feel like it will work so well. But if she doesn't like it, then it's fine. Oh, true. Also that. Yeah, that's kind of like why I wanted to go with Galar 6 or Yun as one of them. That's fitting. Where is the... Uh, this is the PFP? No, that's the... Oh, here. Delete this. Oh! Oh god, I'm messing up my thing. Toxtricity, that's fitting. When it goes to Isis and Wizards, you need familiars. I guess, yeah. They should put a Pokemon to one of her very old debut tweets. Uh, that would take forever to find. Mmm, the crunchy pixels. At 100%, it doesn't look that bad. Maybe a little bigger. This music is a little too intense, actually. Now that I realize it. I wish she would Hatterini somewhere. Yeah, Hatterini is one of the ones I have in mind. Look at the Iraqi. It's a Hunchcrow, Noctowl, or Hoot Hoot. Okay, I uh, need to... I'm gonna start deleting these. Much be much easier. Delete. What is this? Okay, yeah, this is the Pokemon one. Delete. And delete. Okay, this is the Pokemon one. Delete. And delete. There you go. Now this off. And select this. I feel she will have Dark Grey. We're not really doing legendaries though. Dark Grey is a legendary. Those could kind of work with Pokemon like Mimikyu and Banette. I'm thinking of adding Mimikyu. That's one of them. Thinking of adding. Is she on them? Oh, she's not online right now. I was gonna ask her. I was gonna ask her if she likes like how Galar Sigsagoon looks. I was gonna ask her, because I don't know if she has seen Galar Sigsagoon. I feel she has probably only seen normal Sigsagoon. So I wanted to ask her, but... I... She's not online right now. Oh well. GG. Uh, let's see. Okay, I think that should select it. Invert. Then delete. That's not the right... Oh, there you go. That's the right layer. I was like, where'd it go? Dun, dun. Oh. Ooh. Oh, what I messed up. He's like. 
need to move this a little bit more down. There you go. That should do it. Our sexy girl is rock and roll, so it should be fitting for her. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. That's like one of the ones that came to the top of my head that would work really well, but... I feel like I need to ask her. Oh, wait. Too bad grass is an option. Is there many musical grass? I don't feel like... Mm, I don't know if grass would really fit. Just ask her. She'll see the notification. I... I don't know if a lot of the girls would be... Uh, answering right now. I don't know. A lot of the girls are inactive right now. From what I'm seeing. It's kind of fun to see our version, see how they compare with the other girls would actually make. I mean, I guess, like, at the end of the day, we could just do our own versions. Like, obviously, they would probably pick something different than what I'm picking based on, like, what I feel. Would suit. It's always a starter. We're not against starters. The only limit is I'm not doing legendaries for anyone, because I feel that would be a little too imbalanced. Adding legendaries to anyone. Because if I give someone a legendary, I feel I have to give everyone a legendary. And there might not be a legendary that fits all of us. So... I think it's better that way. Uh, it's also a dark type. I feel Zoru and... Nah, I don't see it. I would feel Zoru... If our colors were much darker... So, not really. I don't think Zoro. Mimikyu. Mimikyu is one of them. Hatterini is another one. So, Mimikyu. This one here. We're just gonna ignore that they have the ugly backgrounds right now. So just ideas. So it's more for illusions, yeah. Chandelier. Hatterini. Mm. Hatterini is one. I think the baby one kind of fits better. What was the name of the other one? The 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 pre-evolution. Oh god, what's the name? Hat... Hatterini Pre... Pre-evolution. Yeah, this little guy. What's the name? Hatena. Yeah, I think it has two evolutions, actually. Ah, it's a two-evolution Pokemon. Yeah, I was thinking of Hatram, actually. Yeah, I was thinking of Hatram, but I forgot it has two evolutions. It's Hatram and Hatterini. I think Hatena's cute. I could have Hatena as her starter. I want to put like one baby Pokemon as their starter, just to kind of solidify that kind of like starter vibe. No, what? Well, 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 I'll do Hatena as her starter. So little guy. What's this? Hatena. Okay, I'm gonna put Hatena in. Bum, 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 bum. So big. Blech. Also, hi, hi, doggy. Best of luck at work. How about Hunch Crow? Mm. I guess it could work. Mimikyu is... Is it only ghost or is it dark ghost? I think it's dark ghost? Or is it also ghost? Or is it only ghost? Mimikyu is ghost... Ah, I forget. Mimikyu is supposed to be fairy. Right, 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 right. Mimikyu is supposed to be fairy. Um... Dark... Type... Pokemon. Yeah, Mimikyu is ghost fairy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh... 
Let's see, raccoon Pokemon that are not Sigsagoon. There's only Sigsagoon. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, the only raccoon Pokemon there is is Sigsagoon. And very fits due to our magic and all stuff. Yeah. Fairy type. Um. Hmm. There's also this one that's... No. I'm sure Maggie will like the Galarian Six again. I mentioned it before, but someone says she didn't like Six again. I think Jelly said she didn't like Six again. But I'm not sure if she has seen Galarian Six again. Or if she has only seen Normal One. Just kind of like, why? But I feel Galarian Six again just fits her so well that, uh, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Hmm. I don't know. Yeah, Sixagon is the only raccoon Pokemon, yeah. I'm looking at others right now, I'm trying to think. Toxtricity is very heavy metal. Uh, Spirit Ghost of the table. I guess not. We do have some uh, repeated typings with Nevis. So not necessarily off the table. I'm looking at different Pokemon. Uh... Toxtricity... Trubbish could work since Trashman's like garbage? I guess Trubbish could work? Hmm... I'll add a dozen, maybe. I say we're gonna end up with everyone having a free time. We see all the girls having at least one. Really? I feel like, yeah, most most of the girls will have at least one. Oh, well, this is a maybe. Not sure yet, but... Not sure. I mean, how I'll add Galarian Sigsagoon as a maybe. If I see her online, I'll ask her. But... I don't know if she's gonna be online right now. There's nothing really like Pokemon from Gen 2. I don't remember its name. Is there? Because I, I looked up and I couldn't find anything. Oh, this one's cut off. Ugh. Miss Mage is for the witch hat. Maybe? Which Gen 2? I'm not sure which Gen... Two Pokemon they are thinking. Centred? Is Centred... Isn't Centred more of a Tanuki? Centred... What is Centred supposed to be? It doesn't say. It doesn't say. <laughs> Uh, so this is almost like a small record. It's more of a Tanuki, kinda. Centred and Ferret are ferrets, I'm pretty sure. Is Centred supposed to be a ferret? A ferret? I know Ferret is a ferret, but I don't know about Centred. I don't think Centred's a raccoon, now. Uh, what about the Dar Pokemon that we had from the Fusion stream? Uh, God, what's his name? Uh, I know the Pol- Polcha or something like that? Apparently based on flying squirrels, really? Raccoon dog and a raccoon. Hmm. So it's actually based on flying squirrels, the more you know. Wait, isn't Amolga the one that's based on flying squirrels, not Sentry? Uh, Miss Magius. I think Miss Magius, yeah. Add uh, Miss Magius. Mocha does look like a flying squirrel. Yeah, I'm pretty sure, uh, Miss Magis. What about Ditto? I think Ditto is a bit of a cheat card. <laughs> Besides, Ditto's not really good for much, other than just transforming into other Pokemon. So I feel it's, uh... It's a bit meh of a choice. One, two, three, four, five. 
Uh, what other, what other? Yeah, Ditto's kind of a cheat. It is good competitive, though. <laughs> we'll pick something else that's not Ditto. Something else, something else. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I thought of something. What about Brakeson? Isn't Delphox kind of like a wizard or a witch or something like that? Wait, what about, what actually about? <laughs> Maybe. Possibility? Some sort of fire magician for sure. It's a witch based mon, yeah. The Fox line is good, yeah. You can go with that. I'll put Del Fox. Hmm, which one should I put? Should I put Breaks in or Del Fox? Hey, that's a little, a little bit more variety by adding a fire type. When they try to give starters RPG classes. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Mm, Delphox has a cooler stick. <laughs> Alaka Samson, it's a magic word. Uh, but I feel like that that's like different type of magic though. It's I feel like Breakson would fit better. I'm kinda leading more towards mm, two people say Delphox. Someone said Breakson. Okay. We're gonna we're gonna pull this. Delphox or Breakson. Yes, we're gonna we're gonna run the poll as to which one. Both are good options. Yeah. Breakson has the magic type design. I mean both of them are pretty much from the same line. Mm, I see more votes inclined towards Breakson. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, it seems Breakson is winning. I mean, both are kind of like supposed to be magician type of design. But yeah, it seems breaks in. Okay, breaks in. Breaks in it is. I'll add breaks in here. And make it 50 50. Breaks in looks more of a witch than Delphox. I guess, yeah, that is true. Breaks in has more of the witch aspect than Delphox. I feel, I feel Delphox looks more magician rather than witch. Okay. Yes, I think we can work with this. They did say that her favorite, one of her favorite Pokemon was Mimikyu, so I'll make Mimikyu her starter. But Delphox is more like a wizard with the giant robes. Yeah, it has like more wizard vibes. So breaks and look can be more of a witch type of Pokemon. Okay, yes, yes, yes. Wait, why is Delphox suddenly winning? Stop it. <laughs> why do you suddenly change your mind to Delphox? <laughs> why? You voted breaks it not too long ago. Why are you suddenly changing your minds? <laughs> oh my god. Shaking my head. Now you guys are just waiting for Delphox to close it earlier. Cats is be trolling right now. I'm gonna close it. And if you guys still vote Delphox, I'm about to actually change it to Delphox. So you have 10 seconds to decide for real. Or else I'm actually gonna change it to Delphox. That box is a good choice. You guys literally voted breaks it not too long ago. Time to pull fast. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, it's over. Well, you guys changed your mind, so I guess Delphox it is. <laughs> this high majority apparently went Delphox. No, you can you can blame yourselves for this one. We're actually gonna go Delphox then. You brought this one upon yourselves. <laughs> okay, we're still fox. Okay, where's where's the breaks in file? 
That's Miss Mages. Not me trying to figure out which one is supposed to be the breaks in one. Uh, Y'all fucks you to the win the last minute. Yeah, you guys just changed your mind. Where? Which one is this thing? I can't find which one was breaks in. Is it this one? No. I'm literally just like... Oh, this one was it. Okay. Delete layer. Okay, there you go. <laughs> Rayso is already there. The naming of the layers did not last long. Yeah, because everything just started piling up. <laughs> okay. Oh, I'm just gonna move all of these outside then. Okay, there you go. Ooh. I closed one layer by accident. Which one did I close? There you go. There you go. The fucking strong revolutions I told by. <laughs> I was hoping she couldn't find this so she wouldn't be able to switch it. <laughs> I am switching it. Doesn't matter. You guys wanted this, so... <laughs> Five breaks in my beloved. Okay. And just to solidify that this is final... I already got the picture. So, Del Fox it is. I didn't want this. 45% of us didn't want this, but the, the 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 other majority did. The stronger majority did. And we do democracy in this household, so Unfortunately that's what democracy says. The ever store to fail. I hate democracy. <laughs> oh my god. Dell foxes. They got democracy. Oh my god. It's probably like this, so I don't pixelate it too much. What is this music, actually? I'm not even paying attention to what YouTube is playing, so... Me too. <laughs> the fact that it barely fits is too big! Okay. Kind of like this. This is, this is what I'm gonna have to do. Okay, and then select this. We've come a long ways from when we started with the music. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is uh, this is what we like to call peak. This is what peak music sounds like. Ah. Oh, what is that? That's not what I wanted to do. Okay, there you go. Wow, this is amazing. It's like these two off pixels that are bothering me. Okay, there you go. <laughs> Democracy is just a little too concerned. That's just how it is. Okay, then, uh, there you go. Now, it'll become official. It's becoming official. It's Del Fox now. No more breaks in. It's getting chopped off. It barely fits in this little square. <laughs> I'm selecting individual pixels. The pixels! There you go. He doesn't even fit. <laughs> this is fine. But I should have made him bigger. And just shove him more to the ground. It doesn't even look good. <laughs> I mean, you brought this one upon yourselves. Oh, the pixels. Now it looks worse, actually. Ugh. Actually. Ugh, ew. I don't like how that looks. Get rid of it. It really looks weirdly chopped off. <laughs> it's so crunchy. It is. Delphox is still hard to fit in, since, it, since it's a big evolution. This is gonna take way too long. Why didn't you guys just decide on breaks? <laughs> okay, we're gonna do this. I'm gonna have to chop off his stick. That's just how it's gonna have to be. I like that. 
think this could work. And then... Whoop, copy, paste. And then... Deselect. What is this? What did I do? Layer color, what? There you go, that's better. I didn't want to give it a layer color. Delete. Wait, what did I delete? I made three copies of it! Oh, that's bad. I made two. Oh, there you go. <laughs> I waited for breaks and I didn't change my vote, but some people did. Apparently a large majority. Unfortunately, Delphox doesn't fit well, so I had to use breaks. <laughs> You should have thought about that one before. You should have thought about that one before you actually voted for Delphox. Okay. That will that'll do. That will do. We're just gonna make it work somehow, in some shape or form. However it is, uh, we can make this work. <laughs> Now he's missing the cool stick! His stick is getting cut off! This is how it is. It's quite unfortunate, but such is... Such is life. <laughs> we can't even see the stick! Well, it, it's hard to make it fit though. I would have to cut his arm a bit too much and it would look weird being shoved to the back. But the stick is its whole personality. You still gotta see his face. That's good enough. It is what it is. It is what it is, you know? You work with what you have, okay? You work with what you have. Okay. Well, that's that one. Uh, well, this one needs to be gone. That was not even the right layer, okay. I don't know what layer that was. Here we go. One, three, four, five. Okay. Oh, so, hi, hi, Aura! Welcome, welcome. Uh, to be honest, Delphox looks much better in game than 2D art design, in my opinion. <laughs> Deleted something important? What do you mean? What did I delete? Wait, what do you mean? I didn't delete anything. You're trying to make me worry. I didn't delete anything important! What do you mean? Okay. Uh, let's see. The stick? I don't know what he meant, I'm guessing. <laughs> if you don't know, we have an even worse hint. What do you mean? What did I delete? You guys are just trying to gaslight me. I care about breaks. <laughs> oh. Okay, uh, now Mimikyu. Need to get a good image of Mimikyu. Okay, Mimikyu. Mimikyu, put this one, open your image, and save. There you go, close this, close that one. Okay. I, I had already saved an image of Mimikyu, I saved it twice. Where did I put Delphox? I did put it on the right place, right? Delphox. Mimikyu needs to go here, above the number one. Bum, 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 bum. At least there should be lots of options for Mimikyu since it's such a popular Pokemon. Well, yeah. Mimikyu is a very popular Pokemon. I'm pretty sure it had like a song too. If I remember correctly. Like this. I think it should be good. Yeah, I think like this. Uh, 100%. Yeah, it looks good. Looks good. Now, get this off. The magic wand. And turn on Mimikyu again. Let the hacking begin! Oh my god, it's scary. <laughs> What's up? Katsura, one, two, one, two, one, three, three, seven. Thank you so much for the tip. Thank you so much for the snack. Thank you, thank you. 
I see you have returned. <laughs> I see you're back. We could have a lot of cool stuff, to be honest. They had a special Z move, a song, tons of cute plushies, and so much more. That is true, there was a Mimikyu song. Tattooed on 1337 came back. They have returned indeed. One day, one day I'll discover their identity. <laughs> one day for sure. Okay, let's see. Oh, I need to invert this. Oh. Wait, am I not on the right layer? Where's layers? This? Oh, right, there you go. Does he move Let's Snuggle forever? Mmm. I forgot. Is that the name of the Z move? I forget. I forget if that was the name of the Z move that Mimikyu had. But yeah, that move was a thing. Oh, right. Huh. More you know, that's an interesting name. For the move. Okay, this is. Mimikyu. There you go. That's that. I kind of just forgot. Um, did I just forget about Z moves in general. Yeah, Z moves were not particularly memorable, to be fair. But yeah, Z moves had a lot of silly names. Mmm, they did. They did. Yeah. For real, Mimikyu's already a plushie. I mean, most Pokemons have plushies already. I never played Sun and Moon either. I played... I played Sun and Moon a lot when it first came out, but, um... I think it's been a while since I've touched the game. So my memory of it is kind of vague. Only one I remember is Never Ending Nightmare. Who had that move? I feel like I've heard it before, but I'm not entirely sure who had that move. Oh, what's a good Trubbish picture? I think this one should be good. Save. Sun Moon had so many good Pokemon designs. Mmm, they did, they did. I know a lot of people didn't like Sun and Moon because they had like different gameplay. But I thought it was pretty entertaining. I thought it was neat. I kind of like the, the trial format that they went for. I thought it was pretty fun. Z-moves are an interesting mechanic as limits, although... But maybe they could combine it with Mega? I feel that would have been too overpowered, combining it with Mega. Like I said, I feel like Z-moves were like the, the gimmick of that specific gen. Since I feel every gen kind of has like its own little gimmick. If that makes sense. Okay, where do I put this? Probably here. The Trubbish... Mmm... Trubbish might be good here. Yeah, this so it's a little bit more variety. What is this? Okay, this is... Trubbish. That doesn't be cooler, but I can see why they wouldn't want to continue making new ones every gen. Mmm, yeah. I mean, Megas had a, had a lot of potential. They were nice. I like them. I forgot Gumshoes came from Sun and Moon. Yep. That's from Sun and Moon. Quite... Quite surprising, honestly. But yeah, that, that was a Sun and Moon Pokemon. It's just big little guy. Did it kind of combine it with Mega already Dynamax? It's basically a two of them combined. Mm, I guess you could see Dynamax that way. I feel like it's too zoomed in. I should probably zoom it out a little bit more. Oh. Sure. And I'm gonna make it a little bit smaller. It's too zoomed in. Yeah, I think here should be good. It shows its arms a little bit more. It shows the Pokemon a bit more. Hmm, maybe they thought making a new gimmick would attach attract a bigger audience than keeping the Megas. 
I guess they kind of just do, like, new gimmicks each gen to kind of, like, keep it, um... I guess kind of keep interest and make it, like, you... I guess a little bit unique each gen. That's why the, the Terras in uh, Scarlet Violet... Adelfox really stands out. <laughs> uh, what? You think Adelfox really stands out? Probably because it occupies most of the space, yeah. I guess it works since they keep adding gimmicks. I would say so, yeah, I would say. I wish it kind of worked. In a way, it actually did work. Yeah, it keeps the gameplay loop kind of fresh as well. So, at, in the end, it works out. Game of Smashes... Maybe Miss Magis as a third? Just to not pile up all the baby Pokemon in the front. Honestly, I feel right that they got rid of Megas for so long. Let's you have different kinds of fun. Hmm. I guess it could also be seen that way. Like I said, I feel like they do new gimmicks each gen to kind of keep gameplay like a little bit more... fresh? If that makes sense. Oh. Okay. There you go. I feel like that's like the main thing. Just keeping gameplay feeling uh more fresh. Mega Mawile was really cool. What did Mega Mawile look like the girl? Hmm, I love Mega Mawile. A while. Oh, this one! Oh yeah, it had like two... Um, I guess two mouths in the back of its head? I... I... <laughs> I like Mega Altaria, honestly. I think Mega Altaria is so cute. Mega Altaria's big fluffy bird dragon creature. I think it's adorable. I want a plushie of Mega Altaria. It just sparks a joy. <laughs> it just sparks a lot of joy when I look at it. So, if I had to pick like a favorite Mega, I think of Mega Altaria for me. It's so fluffy. It's so fluffy. I feel rocky as a Mega. I don't mm, I don't think the themes really work though. Yeah, Michael Terry is a really good choice. Very fluffy. Very, very fluffy. Cute. I think here would be a good spot. But yeah, I think this doesn't cut off too much if I put it like around here. Yeah, that should work. Michael Terry is really cute, plus pretty good competitively too. Mmm. Yeah, I've heard it's like really good competitively. Really, really good competitively. It's just a little... It's just a little guy. It's a really, really cute little guy. Today my boy Flygon could have gotten a Mega. I I see that a lot. A lot of people wanted Flygon to get a Mega. And yet he never got a Mega. Maybe one day... One day he might get a Mega. One can only hope. That it will be his time, soon enough. But that day is not today. Someday. Someday. Someday for sure. It was supposed to get one, but it got cut. Was there any reason why it got cut? Maybe it could have moved Miss Madges a bit more down, actually. Yeah, I'm gonna move it a bit more down. Oh. Oh, not the square, but Miss Matt. Ooh, that's not good. <laughs> okay, deselect. There you go. The major, I guess, is design block. Mm. I guess I can see that with design block. I got cut because of the votes of 
T, F, and Ant... And Athers? What do you mean by that? Yeah, I need to cut off a bit more of the body from Miss Madras. I need to readjust. Okay, then... Do this... Okay, maybe now it looks a bit more... Yeah, that looks, a, that looks a little better. I feel like more body. I could still cut more body. Oh, Game Freak. Both trees of Game Freaks and Athers. Mm. Yeah, if I assume it means Game Freak. No clue on Athers. I, I don't really see Game Freak abbreviated as DF. So I was like, what is DF? First time I ever seen Game Freak abbreviated as DF. Well, that's cutting too much body. Maybe like here? I feel like here it could work. Try to manage, try to figure out how much body I should cut. Miss Magic is. Oh, that's wrong. It's the wrong square. This one. And then put Miss Magic back. Invert. Okay, there you go. What's up? Hi, hi, ghost. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, it looks a little better. Oh, wrong layer. Yeah, I think it looks a bit better. I feel like cutting off more body it looks a bit more weird, but that is more relevance in the body, so maybe better we focus on it. Really? Uh, <laughs> I feel like it will look too weird cutting off too much body, but it might be better. Maybe better cutting off more body. Rocky has a cute little team. I'm also her Pokemon are not especially cute. I think Hatata is cute. Miss Mage is just about think it could be kinda cute. Oh, whoops. I moved up. Mimikyu, uh, depending on your taste, it can be cute, I guess. Depending on your perspective, it can be cute. Uh, just don't read the Pokédex entry. <laughs> if you don't read the Pokédex entry, then Mimikyu can still be cute. Uh, but once you read the Pokédex entry, I think it stops being cute. You don't like Mimikyu? I think Mimikyu's design is cute. The Pokédex entry is a little bit disturbing. But, um, you can say that for a lot of Pokémon entries. Like, I think Mimikyu's design is cute. I... I keep moving it and it just won't work out. Work with me, please. I, I literally just moved it. Why? How much down do I have to move it? Like this? Maybe like this. Yeah, I think I have to move it all the way like this. I'm struggling so much just to make Miss Mages fit. Okay, invert. The OG of Curse Pokédex entries was Hypno for me. What was Hypnos' entry again? There you go. Okay! Nice. That's much better, actually. Okay. <laughs> Honestly, when we get so far down, the center of the head is in the middle of the box. I guess, yeah. There you go. I think it, this looks much better. There you go. Hino was absolutely cursed. I don't think I ever read his Pokédex entry. I just didn't like Hypno's design. It gave me bad vibes. Miss Magic said it ended up more problematic than Del Fox. Yeah. Honestly, it ended up being more complicated. Okay, now I need hot. Hatterene. Hatterene. No, not Hatterene. I need Hatena. Yes, Hatena. Yes, that's the one I need. When I think Hatena, I think of Flipnote Hatena, and it confuses me. Mickey is still cute to me, even if I were to die, then I can say I die from cuteness. I mean, that's one way, yeah. Yeah, the Yamask entry is super cursed. A lot of the ghost type Pokemon have cursed entries. A lot of them, I would say. A big chunk of them. 
Where did it go? There you are. There you are. Drifloon is super cute. No. Drifloon, no. <laughs> yeah, these two 3DS coded, of course, Slipknot is what comes to mind. <laughs> Flipnote Hatena was good. Besides, Flipnote Hatena was more DSi era rather than 3DS. Yeah, Flipnote. Yeah. Flipnote Hatena was a service that ran from 2008. Oh. <laughs> right. The painful day to Flipnote Studio. Yeah, Flipnote Studio. Oh, now I'm sad. Okay. <laughs> Garden Boy is one of the most dangerous with creating a black hole. Tiaki stop making me feel old. <laughs> uh. Flipnote, Flipnote Hatena, and Flipnote Studio. Man. Make it a little bit smaller since this is a small Pokemon. I gotta make it. I feel like I don't have to cut too much from this one. There you go. I think one of the ears are gonna get cut off a little bit. Can't believe that Carver Reaper and I know only one, sadly. A lot of Mega Pokemon X entries talk about how they destroy their bodies or send them in a giant rage. Oh my god. They're gonna be able to see it the same way ever again. Literally fate? I think the, the ear. I'm gonna have to cut off the ear a little bit. What is this? Hold on. Forget that one. <laughs> After in being a very violent po uh, very violent Pokemon and people's emotions disturb it. You just move it a bit more to the left. Okay, yeah, so I guess we could have just move it a little bit more to the left. Oh, not this. What are these? Okay, there you go. Nope. It's gonna have a little bit of its ear is gonna have to go. How the center has progressively gotten more and more creepy out of nowhere. This is a random playlist, so it's a random playlist from um this this game that allows uh, people to stream their music as long as you don't upload it. As long as you don't just upload the songs. But if you're just streaming, um, I just noticed I didn't cut her book properly. Uh, <laughs> I need to fix this. Hmm. There you go. That's a little bit better. Okay, now trying to fix Hatterene. Hatena. There you go. There. Fixed. Oh, I think I deleted a little too much. Deleting the pixels. Okay, there you go. And the playlist to be like that. They can go from super happy music to sad to horror music. Yeah, I guess a perfectionist for some things, of course, they'll bother her. Ugh. <laughs> oh, why you gotta? Why you gotta? Why you gotta expose me like this? Okay, now just missing to add the zigzagoon. The gallery is zigzagoon, and then we'll have two. Two would have been completed, and the the, the, the prettifying the cards, uh, it honestly just depends if I have time at this point. I don't know if I'm gonna have time to actually make them pretty. <laughs> okay, where is the thing? Is it really exposing you if all of us already know about it? There may be someone in chat that did not know about it, but now they know about it. You have a favorite gen, if not type? I don't have a favorite type, because I like Pokemon from different types. But... Uh, if I had to pick a favorite gen, I would say Gen 5. I have to say Gen 5. 
because uh, Gen 5 was like the the one that uh, pretty much made uh, made me fully get into Pokemon. Oh, you tired of this Tiaki small bread that loves being pam- Oi, that's not true! <laughs> black and white? Yes. Uh, Gen 5 is black and white. It's Unova, yeah. Gen 5 with N in the good story. Uh, Tiaki? <laughs> yeah, Gen I would say Gen 5 is the one that's my favorite. No, about what? Nothing. Don't worry about it. It is the absolute truth and we all know it, Tiaki. <laughs> Gen 5 is one of the best gens for sure. Yeah. I I was hoping, in a way, I was low-key hoping for a remake. But I was also afraid for a remake. When the Pokemon Direct was announced. Um, because I'm afraid uh, they're gonna get the... Um, Shining Pearl and Brilliant Diamond treatment. Which I low-key don't want them to get. <laughs> so... I don't want them to get the Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl treatment. <laughs> so... That's kind of like why I was a little bit on the fence. If there was actually gonna be a... Gen... If there was a Gen 5 remake, I would have been kind of like really worried. Gen 5 though, spam the crits like crazy. Gen 5 is so hard to Nuzlocke. <laughs> because the the amount of crits you can get on Gen 5, it's crazy. It's really crazy. I tried to... um, uh, I tried to actually... Uh, I think the first Pokemon game I tried to Nuzlocke was Gen 5. That was a mistake. Uh, <laughs> because I got, I got crit so fast. Oh uh, yeah, Gen 5 is not considered the hardest one, isn't it? I'm pretty sure it is considered one of the hardest ones. Oh man. Oh still hi hi Cleody, welcome, welcome. Riptiaki's Pokemon, yeah. There's some possibility we'll just get a Gen 5 remake. Many reliable sources or hell Gen 5 remakes and then suddenly uh PLZA was announced and nobody saw it coming. Yeah, nobody really saw the Pokemon Legends, like, Z and A. I, I don't even know how it's supposed to be pronounced. Z and A? C to A? Whatever it is supposed to be pronounced, but yeah. <laughs> oh man, I really want to take their time if they want to remake five games. Yeah, for sure. Gen 5 was a thing, even though the story was fine, the new Pokemon started man. I mean, you, know, you always get, like, not-so-good designs from every gen, I feel. I feel like no gen has, like, every perfect design. Like, every design is a banger. To be fair. I feel like that's just a general thing. Actually, see, I get favorite Pokemon type. I don't really have a specific favorite type, because I like a lot of different Pokemon. <laughs> za. <laughs> Z to A, Za. <laughs> I remember when I saw the title, I was like, what am I supposed to call this? Pokemon ZA? Pokemon Z to A? A to Z? <laughs> uh, it's a... it's a name. It's definitely... it's definitely a name. He's a... Six... a... Goon... Galler. Gold, silver. I'm mean, pretty sure every gen had their designs that were not that good. Gen 5 also had the most Pokemon added, so definitely it's gonna have some stinkers here and there, but it has some banger designs too. Yeah. It had some really good designs as well. Favorite Gen 5 starter? Oh my god. I... Okay, so I usually tend to go for water types. I, there's been very few times where I made the exception that I don't go for a water type. Gen 5 was the one that actually made me struggle in between choosing a water or a grass type. I really like Snivy, but I also really like Oshawott. <laughs> and like, it, it it made me very conflicted. I was very conflicted. Because <laughs> I really like both Oshawott and Snivy. So I was like, oh, what do I pick? I would say that's the, that's one of the few gems that actually made me like, have second thoughts on who to pick. Both good picks. They were both good picks, yeah. So it was really nice. It was my starter. I I think I... On my different runs, I did different runs with uh, Oshawa and another run with Snivy. Just because I really liked them both and I could not choose one. So instead, I, that's what I did. 
Those are probably will be grass dragon. No. But Sir Perry is more of a snake, not really a dragon. Unless they were trying to base it on the um on the other types of dragons. But I I don't think it fully applies, because Sir Perry doesn't have legs. It's just like full on snake. I think that first one was Oshawa, then I did Snivy for Black and White too. I am still upset. I never got to play Black and White 2. It will always be one of my biggest regrets. Everyone tells me it's so good, and I never got to play it. Because I was on this phase where I told myself I wouldn't play uh, video games anymore. <laughs> that I wouldn't play video games anymore because I... Uh, I was gonna like uh, like normal things or something. I don't know. Her edgy face. <laughs> yeah. That that was that was a thing. <laughs> and I I'm so sad because everyone says there were like such great games, and there hasn't been like any Pokemon sequel that has been as good as those. You know, probably. I mean, I don't know if uh, Hard Gold and Soul Silver would count as sequels more than remakes, since Black and White Two were more like actual like sequels rather than remakes. But a lot of people have told me there has never been like another Pokemon sequel that has been as good, and I'm like, no, I missed it. Ultra Sun and Moon is the closest we've got, but they weren't as good. Yeah, I heard they weren't as good. I feel since Diamond... I guess since the Diamond and Pearl gen, I've played um, every Pokemon game. With the exception of Black and White 2. And... Um, Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. And Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon, that one, I... I did it willingly. <laughs> that one, I pretty much chose to do it willingly, because I... I thought they were selling a DLC for 60 bucks. I was like, you're not, you're not actually gonna force me to pay 60 bucks for a DLC. <laughs> it just kind of, it felt more like it was a DLC rather than a full game. And I was like, I'm not paying full prices for DLC. No, thank you. <laughs> so I just didn't bother. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Oris is remakes. Oris is remake. A DLC for a full game cost, kind of crazy. Oh, man. Yeah, I think everyone thought it was DLC. Mm-hmm, yeah. Well, just some Sun and Moon are really good, though. They were so expensive, though. <laughs> they were so expensive. That was kind of, like, my big thing. Okay, I think that, that did it. There you go. Party, 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 party. Okay, we got two done. Wow. Okay, there you go. All done. Now I'm gonna delete all this. Do, 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 do. Put this here and uh, delete. There you go. Two down. Putty, putty, putty. Two out of five. <laughs> oh my god, it really is two out of five. Okay. There you go this here. Two out of five, like two hours in, yeah. Only three more to go. Looking forward to the 4 a.m. stream. Oh no. <laughs> it really is gonna become a 4 a.m. stream. Oh. When was the last time you save? No save run. We don't do saves in this household. I'm kidding. I should probably actually save. <laughs> I should probably actually save for my own sanity. Okay. There you go. <laughs> I see you like to live dangerously. <laughs> Imagine saving. <laughs> no, actually, I will save. <laughs> Jackie not naming layers or saving. Remember, kids always save. Always save. Save like five times, actually. You never know when a tragedy might strike. <laughs> oh, so actually do save. No one another pizza tower moment. But pizza tower didn't allow me to save. That's different. That's a that's a different situation, because pizza tower didn't allow me to save. 
That one was just evil, okay? Okay, Muna, 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 Muna. Muna. You missed the comical closing of the program before saving. It was not comical. It hurt me emotionally and physically. And mentally. And maybe even financially. It doesn't make any sense, but we'll, we'll pretend it hurt me financially too. Just to add it in. As you said, sometimes Nintendo neglect the good games and retro games. Hmm. But yeah. She never emotionally recovered from the Pizza Tower stream. I was never the same after that one. <laughs> I never emotionally recovered. Rumor says she, she still has not recovered from that. What is this? Oh, this is six again. Three, four, five. There's number five here. There you go. And delete the Hatana one. Delete Miss Mages. Delete Rubbish. And delete Mimikyu. Oh, that's the wrong thing. Uh, delete this. There you go. And delete Profile. Oh, that's also the wrong thing. Delete this one. There you go. Pizza Tire is all Chibiyaki. What do you mean? It was me. Yeah, you don't scare me like that. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Now, might as well just do it from here. Actually. Like this. Up here. Okay, there you go. Control, paste, and then we start tweaking. Can you lower the resolution? Maybe, actually. Edit. Change image resolution. It's already at 72! This is as low as we can get! Okay, uh, 30. Oh, how crunchy. Look at the pixels in the hair. <laughs> I guess. Yeah, it looks like a Boneri. I see Boneri as well. Boneri. Bunnelby? But I don't like Diggersby. <laughs> Honestly, I, th I think Diggersby's kind of ugly. Um, I don't know if it's strong. So maybe Diggersby makes up by being strong. But I think Digger Speed is ugly. Not gonna lie to you. Yeah, I was thinking about yeah the the doggo Fido. I was thinking Fido too, cause that one's made out of bread. Yeah, I was thinking Fido. Digger Speed has huge power, so yeah, he's strong, but he ugly. <laughs> I was right then. He ugly. Okay. Score bunny might fit. True. Score bunny. That's also a good choice. Okay, something like this. You can space a typical dirty woman. <laughs> what do you mean by that? <laughs> okay. Is that also just low pony? They suggested Boneri. I don't know if you guys prefer uh, Boneri or Lopunny. I don't know which one you guys prefer more. Digger's base ugly. But Greedon is ugly as a sin. Greedon is just an RCS mistake. Greedon? I don't think Greedon was that... Was it that ugly? Actually, maybe I'm just misremembering how ugly it looked. Uh, Greedon. It's not ugly it's a it's a little guy i think digger spy is uglier <laughs> i don't think greedon is that ugly <laughs> it's good it's not that bad it, it looks like cute in a weird way okay it's just like a little guy green isn't as ugly as digger spy digger spy is uglier i i argue that digger spy is uglier than greedon greedon's not that ugly it looks so weird <laughs> 
it, it looks a little bit weird, yes, but it's not as ugly as Diggersby. Do you guys want Boneri to be her to be her starter? I think Boneri fits her, as her starter, honestly. I think it's better than Low Pony. I think Low Pony is a bit too much. I I don't see Miuna having a Low Pony. Not gonna lie to you. Yeah, but there's a good starter. Yeah, I think Boneri can be her starter. Boneri. Wait, where did Boneri save? Here. Boom, boom, boom. No, no, Diggersby is just a big chungus. Greedon is an abomination. <laughs> uh. I stand my case that I think... Oh, I still think that... um. Digger Spy is uglier. Where did I put it? Oh, it's right there. Now we shrink. I think the cutest and fluffier, the better it'll fit. Yeah. For sure, yeah. Like, hmm, it cuts her foot a bit too much. Probably like this would work. Around here. Can you hear her fur it since it's cute? The fur it is a ferret though. I was thinking a uh, Boneri, Fido, and something else, but I swear it makes sense. Mina would run into battle with the sticks, so regardless of Boneri being short, it makes sense. I think Boneri just fits her as her starter. Like, I feel it's very Mew now. When I look at it, I'm like, yeah. Still full of wood since she's a toy bunny. Still. Hmm? But Stuffle is a bear, though. Are there any Pokemon based on toys? Also, Rabudu fits since it looked like a ninja. I want to mention Score Bunny. I don't know if you guys prefer Raboot or Score Bunny. If someone mentions we could add Score Bunny too. But I don't know which one you guys prefer. Oh. Mm, Score Bunny is good. Bonnet was a toy. But Bonnet is. Bonnet is spooky looking. <laughs> there we got this one. There you go. Then, um, select. There you go. Another little weapon could be since she's a souls like player. Uh, something with a weapon. There are not a lot of Pokemon that wield weapons. Yeah, Fido is, Fido is another one. Oh, not! Raboot feels better because it's cool. Odd Rib. Yeah, I like Raboot. I feel like Raboot would actually kind of fit her more. One Pokemon that has a more neutral pose, because there's like a running one. Inkaton? Yeah, we can't use legendaries now. Also, Seishin's a dog. But yeah, that's dog with sword. You know they love ninjas or boot feels better. True. Uh, do they not have another picture that's not the running one? I mean, I guess I can make the running one kind of work. Stuff alone are based on stuffed toys. They're more bears though. I feel like it would have worked better if she was a bear, but she's a bunny. Okay, reboot. Where did it? There you are. Look, we're a ninja! Ah, uh, I feel granted just too much of a, uh... Too much of a... Uh, I feel like that's a... Uh, I don't feel it fits. I think Tinkaton. Actually, Tinkaton is a good one. Small little... The small cute, yeah, and with a weapon. Yeah, I feel Tinkaton is good. But that might be leaning too much into the ninja team. Yeah, it's too much into the ninja team. A bit too much. 
Like, her theme is not necessarily ninja, so... Yeah, it doesn't really fit. If she will, if her theming was actually geared towards ninja, then I would def it would definitely work, but I don't feel it works out. We don't think the ton would work really good for me now. Okay, there we go. Then uh deselect and here. This music. <laughs> yeah, this is where I got this song from. <laughs> it's from this playlist where I got this song from. Oh. Oh. Ooh, that's bad. And we're selected. There you go. Oh. There you go. And deselect. So we got reboot. Flaria just because it's orange. <laughs> oh man. I forgot I heard this song in a game. It is from a game. So you wouldn't be wrong. I put Fido on the back on her team. Fido. As soon as the work area is slightly tilted. Oh, it is. There you go. <laughs> it is slightly tilted. It's the name of the game. Name of the game is Heart Bound. That's the name of the game. It's pretty much spelled like this. Heart Bound. Okay, now, where is the thing that I'm looking for? We're looking for a good Fiddle image. Fiddle, Fiddle. Fiddle's really cute. Here's one of my favorite Scarlet Violet Pokemon. It's this little, little dog, little like bread dog. Heartbound, is it by that Mr. Thor fellow? Yeah, I believe that is his name, yeah. I haven't played the, the demo because, um... Well, I think it's an early access, actually. It's not no demo. It's an early access. Um, because I wanted to wait for the full game to be out. I don't really tend to play games on early access. I usually prefer to wait till it's out. So, haven't really... Haven't really played the played their game. It was such a cute design. I saw it early on and fell in love with it immediately. Yeah, it's such a cute doggo. Look at him. He's just a little guy. He's a sweet little pupper. Bum bottom. Bum 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 bottom. Wait, where what's the front? Oh, for this one. Oh, these are tilted. What? Okay, yeah, this is number three. Okay, that's what's been throwing me off. This is actually number three. And this is actually number four. Yeah, this is the third one. Interesting. You know, that was Blade from Elder Ring, so maybe a wolf Pokemon. Hmm. Yamper was awesome too. Oh yeah, Yamper was pretty cute. Maze is stretched, but the substitute plush looks like Kangask. Hmm, <laughs> I can I mean I guess I can kinda see the, the vibes, yeah. Those are like the three. Wouldn't the big one be better? It's more orange, would it? Hmm, I guess feet the the evolution could be better. I mean, the shiny one is... How does the shiny one look? Fido shiny. Oh, never mind. Not the shiny one. Yeah, I don't think the shiny one is that orange. I thought the shiny one was more orange, but no. Hmm. 
Do you guys prefer Fiddle or do you prefer the evolution? Or do you prefer Dash... Dash Spawn? Which one do you prefer? Do you prefer the baby one or do you prefer the... The adult one? The, the adult one is more orange. Beedo versus Dash Spun. Dash Spun's more brown, I thought? It's kind of like a brownish orangey. Mmm. It's very jazzy. It is. I've heard baby personally, but adult does have the colors closer to me, for sure. They're both pretty cute. Mm hmm. True. They're both pretty cute. Dash buns look edible. Fido is a little raw. I mean, Fido is baby. It's like... It's the, the bread is not done yet. My vote goes to adult. I remember Fido also because that means she doesn't have to reuse this square. <laughs> okay, yeah. Seems like a uh, great majority. Oh no, you're not gonna do this again, are you? <laughs> Time full. I'll give 10 seconds before I close it, before I get- we get another Delphox situation. <laughs> okay. 9... 8... 7... 6... 5... 4... 3... 2... 1... Okay, it's over. <laughs> okay, fetal it is. Let's tie it up. No, don't you there. It's not like we can change votes. Are you sure you can change votes? How do you? How did the Delphox situation happen then? Hmm. Care to elaborate how that happened before? Can you actually not change votes? Yeah, we can't change votes. The. I don't think you can, as far as you know. That was a coup. <laughs> was it really a coup? I wonder, I wonder. <laughs> Plead the fifth. Yeah, changing votes is not possible. Delphox gang was just waiting till the end to troll. <laughs> oh my god. Truly waiting till the very end. Okay, Tinkleton. Yeah, Delphox one was a lot of people started voting after you already started. <laughs> Delphox one was truly the silent majority. Sometimes you to randomly allows it to do votes twice for some reason. Huh, interesting. Very interesting. Okay. Where do you guys would prefer to go to add Tinkaton? Do you guys prefer to add it as a third or last? I know Tinkaton's very strong. So and where do you guys prefer Tinkaton? Would you like it on a third slot, or would you la like it at the end? Wait, what's the criteria for Miona's Pokemon? We're pretty much adding it based on her theming. We're pretty much adding everyone based on their themes. So, Miona is a bunny. She really likes bread a lot. I don't think I can find, like, any good toy Pokemon. I don't think we got a better option for Ace right now. Yeah. Eat Rhoda? I don't know if that fully fits. Tinkaton's usually used as a support, so third. Mmm, okay, third. Uh, he wrote him, it's kind of a unique idea for the oven for baking. I guess it could also work that way. He wrote him as an oven, so maybe. Mmm, maybe, maybe. It is kind of orange and also like the oven theme. Is Rotom considered a special Pokemon? Hmm... Stuffle is kind of the only stuffed Pokemon. I feel like Teddy Ursa would be cute. But since Stuffle is a bear, I'm a little bit unsure about Stuffle. Maybe Skitty since she's part cat and also likes Sanrio. Maybe Skitty? Part cat. <laughs> Maybe I feel Skitty could lurk. I mean, it works better than Delcati, for sure. I mean, that really likes cats, too. So maybe? Could work. I still need to add Tinkaton, but... Uh, I need a good Tinkaton image. Tinkaton. I know, but not anymore for Rodom. Meowth? Mm, I feel like Skitty works better than Meowth. 
Tin Carton. Okay. And we add Tin Carton. And over here. Where are you? There you are. This is on third slot. What is this? This is actually number four. Beetle here and Tinkaton. This is number three. Okay, there you go. Is Whismer based on bunnies? Oh, not sure. I'm not sure if Whismer is based on a bunny per se. What is Whismer based on? We still need a sleeper, so we could use a Sumeril. True! A Sumeril could... A Sumeril will be a cute choice, Jill. Belly dance a Sumeril. Yeah, I think a Sumeril will be cute. We'll do that. Nope, sadly. I feel like the hammer needs to show more. But it's gonna be hidden since it's so big. Uh, okay. We're just gonna work with this. Unfortunately, the hammer is just gonna get hidden. Okay. Whismer seems to be possibly based on a rabbit or stuffed animal. Whismer is not from bunnies. And what is Whismer based on? Yeah, I think the hammer is gonna have to go. Yeah, the hammer is gonna have to go. That's just how it's gonna have to be. We're gonna have to remove a big chunk of the hammer. Not the hammer. I feel it looks really weirdly cropped. I feel like I need to make this bigger, but that's gonna crop the hammer even more. Like, it looks we very weirdly cropped. Oh, no. Oh, great. Um, sorry, we're gonna have to make it bigger. So it's gonna have to crop even more hammer, actually. More hammer is gonna get cropped. I think with that crop, we can't even tell it's a hammer. No hammer, just hand. <laughs> yeah, there's just no space. There's just not enough space. It looks really weirdly cropped otherwise. Even better, I'll hammer the most important part. <laughs> but then it wouldn't make any sense. It would look really weird if we crop any if we crop more. It's just gonna have to go. The hammer barely is barely visible in here, but. Actually, I think I need to move it a little bit more. Oh, I moved the selected area. Whoa! That's not good. There you go. That gives a little more room for hammer. And then go back to this. Go invert. And then go Tinkaton. Yeah, that shows a little bit more hammer. Not that much, but, you know, <laughs> a little bit more. There you go. Tinkaton, it's an iconic baton. <laughs> She's teasing us with the slightest amount of hammer visible. I'm trying. I really am. Good night, Tiak and Katarons. Good night, Anjali. Thank you for stopping by. Whisper as a concept is based on earmuffs. I think it's based on an audio output device like speakers. He's just a little guy. Mm, he's based on speakers. Would actually work, really. We do... I want to add a Zoomer reel. I think a Zoomer reel is cute. I think a Zoomer reel could work. And, and it adds a little bit of variety with a water type. Really, Muna is always going to sleep napping when she shows up on my Twitter feed. So how does a Muno Musharna sound? Hmm. I mean, Muno Musharna could also work. Is Sumeril and Mino play Gong Gong on her belly? <laughs> I think Sumeril is a cute choice. Also, Bunny adds a little bit of variety as well with the water typing. So, Sumeril. Musharna could work. 
Muna is really cute. Would you guys prefer Muna or Mushar now though? Assume Muriel is a monster. <laughs> Why? He's just a, just a little guy. Just, a, just an innocent little creature. You would, you would never, you know, you never think anything would happen with a Sumerail around. Look at it. So, so small and innocent. So egg shaped. <laughs> it actually kind of has the shape of an egg. Look at that. A little egg. You can't trust those eyes. Those eyes hold darkness within them. What? No way. We never heard a fly. I don't know what you guys are running about. Sumerail is a monster. Either belly drum sweep or choice band aqua jet sweeps. It's the, it's the resident sweeper. Look at it. A little guy used to demolish rank battles. <laughs> He's just a little guy. It's, I never noticed how egg shape it really is. Until now. I like this. It's gonna get, mm, but the ears get cropped too much. So maybe like this. The cute little sweeper. It's a cute little sweeper, yes. It's a cute little guy. Resident sleeper reference. And next time that from Tiaki. <laughs> I seen the things he does and he haunts me. <laughs> Why? You think he's too terrifying? He's just a little guy, you know. He's a resident little guy. There, there you go. Now... Da, 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 da. I feel like it's too weirdly to the side. It's an Easter Bunny, so he's literally an egg. Huh. That makes sense. That makes sense why he's so egg-shaped. I feel like he's so weirdly to the side. How can that little thing be terrifying? I don't know. I don't know why, why some of you seem to be very terrifying. Very terrified of this creature. It's just a little guy. Just a little guy. Famous last words from every boss Amy you <laughs> uh, The famous last words. He's a neat little fella, indeed. Just a neat little fella. Wouldn't hurt a fly. Because all flies would run away before he could even hurt them. That's that's why. But we don't uh, we don't talk about that. There you go. Okay. So, the last contender. I know Muna Musharna was uh, one. I feel like I saw someone else comment a different Pokemon. Oh, Whismer. Okay, how many options can I can I put? Uh, poll. Uh, which one? Okay, which one? We got Muna... Slash Musharna. Oh yeah, Ro Rodom Heat. Yeah, Rodom Heat. And we also got Whismer. Do we have a fourth option? Okay, we we have one more one more space. So I mean Muna really likes music. So Whisper could actually work, since it's also kind of like bunny themed and also apparently based on the speaker. We already uh, we already added Rodom Heat. We got Muna Musharna, Rodom Heat, Whisper. Any any fourth choices? Or do you guys only have those three? Boom boom boom. Dancing Ludicolo? Mm. Uh, nah, I wouldn't say Ludicolo really fits her. Nah, 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 nah. Jigglypuff? Actually, a low key baby. <laughs> I could actually low key see Jigglypuff. Jigglypuff. Okay. There you go. Okay. I'll leave you guys to vote while I go BRB for a little bit. So, you guys, it is time. It is your time. I'll be right back.
Welcome to Nylena! Okay, I'm back. <laughs> okay, what are you... Oh my god, you actually tied it! <laughs> I can't believe you guys actually tied it. Oh no, and it's tied again. Oh no, oh no. <laughs> oh, that's just... Mm. <laughs> that's not good. It's 31%. Both uh, Rodam Heat and Jigglypuff. Hmm. Second ball between the two winners. What if you guys just tie it again? <laughs> Need a tiebreaker, Chiaki? Hmm. I need to be re reminded how Rodam Heat looks Nailina. like. New one year, let's go! Pleo Pleo! Thank you so much for being a member of Nailina for nine months! Thank you, thank you! Also, Ara! Thank you so much for being a member of Nailina for two months! And Reaper! Thank you so much for the Supa! Rodam Heed for the sweet competitive strats! <laughs> and Atoroto! Thank you so much for the Supa! Thank you, thank you! And Raps! Thank you so much for the Supa! Thank you, thank you! And Tomblen, thank you so much for the super. Thank you, thank you. Hmm. Do a flip, Chiaki. Oh, Jigglypuff just won. Someone just broke the tie. Okay. Someone just broke the tie. Jigglypuff at 32%. <laughs> yeah, okay. Jigglypuff won. No! Yeah, someone, someone voted. The tie has been broken. So, Jigglypuff it is. No, another voted quickly before she closed it. It's been close. It's been close. So Jigglypuff it is. Okay. Jigglypuff. The last minute tiebreaker. The last minute tiebreaker just came in time. So no no Rodom oven. Oh Miss Rodom Heat. The public has voted. <laughs> Democracy. That's just how it is, democracy. Ah, it's a weapon! Terrible. Fido will remain forever unbaked. <laughs> I mean, same case with Fido. You ask for Fido instead of Dash Spawn, so. The Gen 1 favorite. Yeah, the Gen 1 anime favorite. Bring back the monarchy! <laughs> No, we're having democracy in this household. <laughs> okay, Jigglypuff. It's how with democracy embrace tyranny. 
Why? Why, 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 huh? Okay, let's see. I uh, need to add Jigglypuff. Where? Oh, there you are. Jigglypuff. Bum, bum, bum. There you are, little guy. Democracy killed my oven. <laughs> I'm so sorry that democracy killed your oven. Maybe one day you'll get your oven. But that day is not today. <laughs> How would monarchy even work out? I decide everything. <laughs> if if it was a if it was a monarchy, I decide everything and I don't ask any of you. <laughs> and I don't ask chat for their opinion on the matter. That'll be a demo that'll be a, a a monarchy. I'll be like, okay, we're doing this like this because I said so. <laughs> Chaggy just picks all the teams that we sit here. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> it's already a monarchy? What do you mean? It's not a monarchy. Sorry, Oven, you have to be replaced. What about a ranger monarchy? You wouldn't want that. <laughs> the Quitiag is the only ruler of the house. It almost fits perfectly. If it wasn't because the ears, because it's tilted to the side. I'm like, so you're gonna have to chop the ears a little bit. It is what it is. When we ask why, Chiaki doesn't say anything. <laughs> what do you mean? Are you sure Ranger does seem like a good king? What are you implying by that? If it's a monarchy, I think we're legally required to call you queen. And I don't think you want that. No. I feel it'll feel really awkward. <laughs> it'll feel so awkward being referred to as queen. He's like a better ruler? What do you mean? You don't trust that I'll be a good ruler. Jigglypuff has the perfect roundness. It would almost fit if it wasn't because it's tilted. Oh, this song is a banger. <laughs> Kuchiyaki, oh no. I think I'd rather not. No comment. Oh, want the truth? I feel the truth is gonna be very mean, so I don't think I want it. I think I'm good. Quinchiaki has happened in the past. No, it has not. Okay, there you go. Okay, we got three. Bada beam, bada boom. <laughs> About Princess Chiaki then? Uh, uh, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. It, it, it just feels like... Mm. Quinchiaki Ojosama laughter. I can't do an Ojosama laugh. You already have your dress, so Queen Tiak is pretty much real. But that's more of a princess dress rather than a queen's dress. I actually think we, should, we would be supposed to call her Our Majesty. Yeah, wouldn't it be like, yeah, or Ma Majesty? I guess it depends, I guess. Queen Tiak will be too sweet to punish, but so bratty. <laughs> what do you mean? You're technically Queen of the King of the Castle stream. That didn't last very long. Uh, Tiaki sama <laughs> Oh my god. Your Majesty, can you bring my oven back to life, please? No. <laughs> no. The oven, the oven dream is dead. It was a short-lived queenhood. It didn't last very long. Yeah. Hey, change this moon. <laughs> King in the Castle Street was an event and a half. Yeah. For sure. Okay, duplicate. Tiaki <laughs> Sama, how is your day going? Oh god. I, I think I'm good. I think I'd rather not have the royalty treatment. I, I think I can live without it. Also, hi hi, Tomlin! Tiaki Sama, how is your day going? Oh no. <laughs> oh no, another. I I'm good. Chiaki Sama, will you manage to do <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> not not the Tiaki Sama. <laughs> Tiaki Sama ID. <laughs> oh no. Tiaki doesn't want the lady treatment? No. I think I don't. I think I'd rather not. I think I'm good. I think I'm good with the lady treatment. <laughs> Tiaki Sama, we need. <laughs> 
Oh no, I I'm good. I I rather not. <laughs> I rather not be treated as a queen. Kekisama, we would like to talk with you about your car extended quarantine. Quarantine? Wouldn't it be warranty? My lady tips fedora. <laughs> oh no, not the fedora. <laughs> okay, Kekisama, we shall stop. <laughs> Not the actual kneeling emoji. <laughs> oh no. This has gone too far. Would you prefer your highness or my liege? I would prefer neither, actually. <laughs> or had to be put in quarantine. How styles hackers hacked it. <laughs> oh god, the kneeling. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Okay, I think that should be all. Now... But if you're the queen, you could demand anything from us, Katsus Chiyagi-sama. I'm not really demanding, no. I've been driving a while, but Dora Chiyaki is. Oh no, she's gonna be real now. Oh no, my lady then? Oh no, not that my lady. It reminds me of the fedora meme. Like, my lady. Tips fedora. Just the kneeling. The fedora crown. How would you even make a fedora crown work? Also, hi, hi, Cyril. Welcome, welcome. My hacker. <laughs> Tiaki chan kun senpai sama. I'm pretty sure that the, those are not used in the correct way. <laughs> you know, it's funny because being referred to as sama is actually quite common in Japanese business emails. Is it actually common in emails? Fedora monarchy. Hi, hi, Cyril. Welcome, welcome. I need to... Okay, I need to add the picture for Lati. Tiaki Tono. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that was more of a samurai thing, if I remember correctly. Yeah, emails are super formal in Japanese. Hmm, makes sense. Makes sense. Some is used for any superior, be it boss, client, or superior at work. Hmm... The more you know, the more you know. Also, hi, hi, click. Welcome, welcome. Oh, no, not here. Uh, gonna have to drop this so it's easier. Actually, just from here. No, not from here. Like this. Actually, no. It needs to be much higher. Like here. Here. So I can make it work on the picture much better. Da -dun -dun -dun. Well, you usually aren't gonna call your boss Sama. It's a bit too much. Yeah, I feel like it's a bit too much. A bit too much for sure. Okay, there you go. I think that works. Oh, wait. When did her... Huh. Wait, when did her... Oh, one of her gills got... Uh-oh. Wait, when did that happen? Was it... Wait, this has been... Did I... It... Was that the PNG? Wait, let me check the PNG. Oh my god, that is her PNG! I just noticed that. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> Has it always been like this? I mean, apparently this PNG that I have of her... Yeah. It, it has always been like this. Why, why is one of her gills cut off like that? Cannot unsee. It is ogre. Oh. Oh boy. Um, maybe if I put her like more to the side, it won't be that noticeable. Did the one she gave you like as well? The one that I got that I that I have from her, which is a full body, yeah. It, it is like this. I don't know why it is like this. Just hide the kill. Yeah, I'll have to hide that kill. So uh... it's gonna be very oddly to this side, but this is all for the sake of hiding this. It's okay, they grow back. Maybe if I make it bigger so it goes more to the side. Almost. A little bit more. Almost. 
there you go. That, that can work. I can work with this. <laughs> you did a little surgery and copy the tip of the other gill and inverted it. I feel like it might... It might not look good. <laughs> I've seen the cut before when I have used it as a reference, but from far away is invisible. You can only see it up close, yeah. The first time that I noticed this cut. Oh, uh, where you know? Okay, invert. Oh, ah! That's not it. Okay. Uh, invert. There you go. <laughs> that was the wrong button. No one will ever know the cut was there. No one will ever know. You'll never have to know, yeah. Okay, there you go. Then, oh. Right, I'm on the wrong layer. See, you can't even tell. As if nothing ever happened. <laughs> you can't even tell. The real question is, does Lottie know? I don't, I'm not sure if she, if she's aware, but... Now you can't even tell. It's as if nothing happened. No mistake at all. No, nothing happened, okay? <laughs> Wait, is Lottie off-centered? She's not off-centered. She's not off-centered. Uh, whooper shiny. I'm looking for the shiny whooper specifically. Uh, there's that. One. There you go. If we're both whooper forms, that will be repeating Pokemon though. I usually try to not repeat Pokemon. We're gonna give her the shiny whooper as her uh starter. Yeah, that one whooper is obvious. Yeah, it's so hard to find a good image though. Uh. We shiny Vaporeon? We need shiny Swampert. Why shiny Swampert? How does shiny Swampert look? Oh, it's also pink. <laughs> I see why. I'm trying to get shiny Wooper, but... I guess we're gonna have to use this image. Shiny Swampert is purpley. It's kind of like magenta. Tiny Swamper is like magenta colored. YouTube is buffering. Okay, where... Where did it go? No. I have way too many tabs open. This is not good. <laughs> okay, I got the whooper. Oh, that's Lottie. That's, that's not the correct one. There you go. And then put this one on number one. Have I exclusive most of the Pokemon tabs? I probably should, because I have too many Pokemon tabs open. Yeah, I already used that one. I already used the Tinkaton one. I probably have to leave, so thank you, Your Highness, or the fun Pokemon audience. <laughs> Have a fun time, everyone, with the cute Princess Yagi. Bye bye. Bye bye, Blade. Thank you for stopping by. Hope that you have a good rest of your day or night. Okay. Now I need to make this one work. Its head is too big. Maybe if I chop the. No, it looks a bit weird if I chop his body. Maybe I'll just shrink it. There you go, now it fits. There you go. It fits just right. Didn't have to crop anything. There you go. Just right. Just making him a little guy. It's just a little guy. There you go. Now... Literal fade. He was just meant to be on that square. I can see Tyranitar, yeah. Kind of like the Kaiju type of... I just think about the baldness. What do you mean? This is how Tyran not, not Tyranitar. This is how Wooper always looks. Yeah, I'm gonna have the Kaiju vibes. Yeah. 
So Tyranitar is one. The poor guy bought at such a young age. <laughs> Oh my god, what do you mean involved at such a young age? It's Tyranitar. I saw Salamander Pokemon would be funny given Leslie. Are there any Salamander Pokemon? Hydrate is a Kaiju kind of looks like an Axolotl. Hydrate is more supposed to be like a Hydra rather than a Kaiju. Uh, where did I save Tyranitar? Okay, there is Tyr... That's Wooper. Okay, there you go. I should probably close all of these. Uh, yeah, I don't need... I really don't need this one. Nor that one. Nope. I don't need the Galar 6 again. And close. Do not save. Do not save. Okay, there you go. Mm, let's see. Her dragon does resemble King Ghidorah a tiny bit with a multiple heads and a dragon. Mm, Tyrande for a lot of your back's caliber. Mm, max caliber. I forgot about Bex caliber, not gonna lie to you. <laughs> oh man. I forget I forgot that this guy existed. Because I'm pretty much just played like base uh base game of Scarlet and Pearl. Salandid is a Salamander Pokemon. Oh, but uh, I, I don't know if Salandid truly fits. Salandid is a I don't feel like it has the same vibes as Lottie. The music is buffering. You too. Okay, there you go. Thank you. Okay. Tyranitar is gonna be the same issue as with Delphox. Cropping it in a way that looks decent. Uh, how do I crop you? He's kind of like this. It looks decent. <laughs> I can't blame you, Bex Caliber is not the best suit of Legendary to me, but it's pretty evil Arctibax. It's fantastic in my opinion. Hmm. I like this. Should work. And then turn this off. And then this. Oh. Ugh. There. How are you doing this? Okay, there you go. And then we enable this. And invert go back to this. Oh. There you go. Go back to this one. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -bum. Delete the body. Mm, maybe I should have trimmed the claws a little bit more. I mentioned Tarantrum. She loves that Pokemon. Tarantrum? The dinosaur one? Tarantrum. Yeah, it's a little. Yeah, it's a T Rex one. I don't think we have mentioned Tyrantrum. Easily. Didn't know she liked Tyrantrum. Yeah, didn't know she liked Tyrantrum either. Ooh, that's not good. Uh, deselect. I need to center this a bit more. Okay, turn this off. Magnifying. Why does it keep selecting it like this? Okay, there you go. And invert. Go back to Tyranitar. Delete this. Delete a little bit of the spikes and the top of the head. Claws. Okay, now it looks better. Okay, now that looks way better than before. Okay. There you go. Arctibax was cool because it looked more like a dinosaur. Hmm, any other Pokemon that are Pokemon? Hmm. Looking at pink Pokemon that could kind of fit. Pink Pokemon. 
little guy kaiju. <laughs> yeah, it's just a little guy and then just Tyranitar. Looking at pink Pokemon right now. See what would actually fit? Hmm. Melodic? I could kinda see. Wait, what about. Hmm, no, wait. I was thinking about, like. What's the name of this Pokemon? Was it Clam Pearl? Clam. Pearl. Uh, Clam Pearl. I think Clam Pearl would be cute. And like the uh, the pearl. Oh, Gory Beast? No, no, no. The pre evolution. Clam Pearl. No, not Gory Beast. Clam Pearl. I don't know why. I feel like Clam Pearl could actually fit with her. Uh, please, YouTube. Thank you. Oh my god. Yeah, I think I should probably just go back to. <laughs> the one song because YouTube keeps buffering so much. YouTube, please. I have to keep resetting. The sad music time. <laughs> YouTube is just completely dead. It is. It is. Glam pearl. Okay. What about love disc? Mmm, maybe like a little bit more variety so we don't lean too much into water types. I feel like we're leaning too many into water types. Like, uh, it would be nice if we could have a bit more variety so we don't lean into just, uh, just pink. Yeah, I'm trying to think something that's not a water type. I think Clamper could work, but. Any random choice, but what about Oricorio? Hawaiian dancer. Oricorio. Hawaiian dancer? Oh, wait. I think this, this Oricorio looks cute. Yeah. Actually, I think this one's really would fit her. I, will, I could kind of see the Lottie vibes on this one. Yeah, the dancing bird. I mean, she does do a lot of, like, um, uh, clips on, um, on Twitter where she's dancing. So I feel like it would actually, it would actually fit. She usually does a lot of, like, those, uh, Twitter clips of her dancing. So I think this Oricorio would be cute. Guys, I felt like it might fit, but wasn't sure. I think it actually fits, actually. I feel it does fit her vibe. A nice water, but shiny whale or... Mm, try not to go with too much water, honestly. Because I feel it's... I want to give them like a little bit more variety and not lean too much on the water element. I already have like shiny whooper. So... Oh boy. Dragapult. I think I'm Pharaohs. It could have one of the gorillas or monkeys to represent King Kong. <laughs> oh, it's a monkey. Monkey, monkey. Let me add Oricorio first. Hmm. Which slot? Maybe if I have YouTube open on a different tab. Please. Maybe if I have YouTube not on like... Maybe that will work. Oh god, this is so... So many tabs. Because it keeps stopping because it's, um... Since I have it minimized... Maybe this will do it. Oh god. My second monitor is a mess with all the tabs. <laughs> Was this some of the tabs would help? No, because I need to open... Uh, I need to open multiple tabs to kind of like look up at the Pokémon. We base and go, it's slack. <laughs> Who cares if we can only attack every other turn when you can just hit Toys Band, get going back. <laughs> I have too many tabs open, yeah. I have too many tabs. All the tabs. 
All of them. Why choose one when I can have them all? Where do you feel Oricorio? Maybe like third? Or do you want it to have it at the back? Hey, where did Oricorio go? Big debate, big debate. I don't know where to put Oricorio. Hmm, give me go as a silly guy. What type of Pokemon is it even support? I feel it looks more like a support. I'm not sure. Not sure what type of Pokemon this is. I don't really use Oricorio. I'm not sure if Oricorio is more support. Of course, it's probably a sweeper. I guess if it's a sweeper, it could be like a secret ace at the back. That's, him. That's surprising. I wouldn't really see this Pokemon as a sweeper. Okay, and I'm gonna put this one at the very back. And this... Not even that worked? Come on, you two. Yeah, I have to be refreshing every other song now. <laughs> Why are you doing this to me, you two? It got banned in lower tiers due to having Quiver Dance. Man. Oh, wait, no. I feel like I should move it more down. Show a little bit more of the head. Less of the skirt. Its head gets... Oh, chopped off too much. I like this, I would say. There's a bit more of the head. Please? Mm, Oricori is an in-between kind of mon. Can be support or sweeper? Hmm. Interesting. So it can be both. Oh. There you go. Fix that. And... Yeah, that side is fine. And then invert. Pukumuku! Hmm. Uh, hmm. I. Oh my god, I can't find a good way to put it. I feel like its head is getting too chopped off still. Oh. Not good, not good. Not good. Yeah, I feel like I need to get rid more of this here. It has to be minimized more. Or just be better to shrink it more, really. But I feel like it's not gonna be, like, distinguishable if I shrink it more. But maybe. Be like that. Hmm. Maybe. Okay, then let's minimize this. Magic wand. I think I need to increase the tolerance. Nope, still not good enough. Higher. Okay, there you go. Much better. Okay, then invert and start deleting things on Oricorio. Looks much better, yeah. Looks much better. No more leftover pixels on the edge. <laughs> I mean, there is a little too much space on the left, but... Uh, this is fine. <laughs> this is fine. I'm just gonna leave it like that. I don't perceive it. Uh, puku. Pukumuku. But Pukumuku is also water. I mean, I guess we can have another water type. As long as we don't have too many water types, honestly. It's gonna have a nice amount of colors, so no problem. <laughs> I mean, I guess having two waters is not too bad. In a bad they had two waters. Yeah, this is I don't want the team to be pure water. 
All right, I have to get going. Thank you for the stream, Tiaki. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye, Red. Thank you for stopping by. Thank you, thank you. Okay, where should we put Pyoko Milku? Third, fourth, or fifth? I don't know where do you guys think you will fit better. Only two waters isn't too much. I think... Just might need to stop with that. Yeah, we will have to leave it at two waters. Not too much water types. Fourth? Maybe fourth? So we don't have like two waters at the top. Maybe we can have the fourth one. Hmm. I think the fourth one actually might work better. My dice roll says four. <laughs> We're just rolling a dice. Relax kind of mono the fear side. Would that actually feel... Grandpa looks like an old man, though. <laughs> I don't think we know what's make you, But Miyuna did end up with four fairy types. I think a ton is fairy. So it's assume well Assumeriel is water fairy. Uh Tinkaton, I think it's fairy steel. Fido is is it normal fairy or is there fairy normal? Fido. Oh, that's a pure fairy, never mind. Um <laughs> Okay. So pretty much no no main like two no like let's not have more than two pokemon that have fairy as the main so tinkaton and uh fito are both fairies as our main typing if it's a secondary typing i think it's not too bad because the has a secondary typing it's a water fairy so its second type is fairy but it's not its main type so i think it shouldn't be too bad uh, it's on Deal Blade Summer and primarily fairy. No, Jigglypuff, it's norm. It's normal fairy. Jigglypuff is normal fairy. Assumerio is water fairy. So their primary types are not fairy. Only Fido and um, Tinkaton are both fairy. Are both main fairies. So yeah. As long as there's not like too many that are that have their main typing be fairy, I think it should be fine. We'll limit to like two water main types. If it's a second type, then I don't think it's that bad. Yeah, because they had fairy added to them. Yeah, it was the later edition. Okay, I need to get a good Pukumoku picture. Like you just say he's Jigglypuff from Gen 1. Boom, not fair. <laughs> okay. Then we got this guy. And you should be four. Okay, I have Chansey. Ooh, Chansey's a cool. It's a cute choice. I think Chansey kind of has Lottie vibes. Isn't Chansey like the, the, the... It's usually known as the healing. Well, you usually see it in like the anime for like the Pokemon centers. So I, I feel like... It kind of fits. Like Chansey has healing vibes. And I feel for um, Lottie kind of has those vibes. So I feel like it, it, it would work. I feel like it would actually work. Okay, Pukumoku, it's some I need to shrink. For typing right, I've got a Flaffy of Pinkorchin. Pinkorchin isn't pink though. Hmm. I might need to make this one be a little bit higher. There you go. It's just right. No need for further adjustment. So this need to go here. Oh. Wait, where did he go? Is he behind us? Oh. Did I... Why do the numbers keep getting messed up? What even? Is this number... Oh, this is number four. What? Okay. Number four. There you go. 
I keep messing up these numbers. Okay, there you go. It's number four. <laughs> okay. So, Chansey. Uh, Chansey on third or fourth? Yeah, I'm pretty much just duplicating. So, I don't have to redo the squares all over again. Okay, so... We're gonna go with... Um, Chansey... Heracross? Mm, I don't really see any bug Pokemon. Are we doing any others like Melodic? Uh, we already have two waters. We're pretty much leaving only two water primary types. If it's secondary type is water, then it's not too bad. But I don't want to have too many Pokemon that have a... Uh, water as their main type. Just to kind of give the team a bit more variety. I don't really see Heracross. Chansey, I do. I can see Chansey. Yeah, I want to not make it too center on a single type. Yeah. I kind of want to give it like a bit of variety type thing. Okay, Chansey. I want to take it there will fit her tropical feel. <laughs> Hello, let it take you to her. <laughs> it's not gonna fit. It's like, it's a uh, neck is too long. I don't think it's gonna fit in here. I'm a Rouge. I'm a Rouge. I'm a Rouge. Let me see. I'm a Rouge. Ooh, I would say it's definitely pretty out there. Yeah, it has like a very medieval feeling. I don't really see it fitting with Lottie. To lasso! Interesting choice. <laughs> Oh, it, not not what I would have thought, but uh, I mean, Salasal is an interesting choice. I still think it's a Ludicolo since it's silly dancing Pokemon. It's Gas Water. I mean, it's secondary typing is water, so like it could work. Okay, I'm gonna add Chansey. I might leave the the last one for voting for the vote. Salasal is a Salamander, yeah. I will leave the last slot, the third slot, for the vote. Which one? So you got Salazzle, which is a, a choice. Uh, Ludicolo. Alola and Exeggutor. Exeg... Exeggutor. And... I don't know if there's any more other than that one. Tyrantrum? Isn't it similar typing to... Tyranitar? What typing is Tyrantrum? Oh, I think it's raw. I think Tyrantrum is rock. Yeah, rock dragon. True. Never mind. Yeah, it's rock dragon. Tyranitar is ground... Rock, I think. Tyranitar. Yeah. Oh, Tyranitar is rock dark. They're both rock types. It's it's not too bad since it's uh uh there will only be two rocks. It's not too bad. I'll be here long, but I'm glad I got to see you again. I hope I can see you on next stream or Monday. Have a great day and night. Good night, Tiaki. Good night, Dontavius. Thank you for stopping by. Hey, okay. Tyrantrum. Okay. Well, you guys decide. On on those, I will be getting a picture for Chansey. Let me see, where did my music go? It stopped again. Oh, I think the playlist ended. <laughs> oh no, okay. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Okay, I got a good picture for Chansey. Oh, there it is, Chansey. I voted for the cool T-Rex. <laughs> we shall see what the votes end up being. I'll close the poll once I finish adding Chansey here. So you have that time while I set up Chansey. Okay, third. You gotta have Tarantula, especially if Lottie likes it too. Dun, dun, dun. You know my favorite thing, Chansey says Chansey. 
Honestly, Tarantar Taran and Tarantrum actually support each other well due to the... There's a Tyranitar setting up Sandstorm to buff Tarantrum. Oh. A YouTube subbing might be the RAM savory that stops auto-loading of tabs that you're not focused on. So maybe pinning YouTube tab on one side helps. That's what I try to do. Like, I put YouTube on a separate side of my screen, but still it keeps... For some reason... Stopping. It keeps buffering. So I'm not sure. Like, I open a separate uh, tab and just put it um, on my screen, away from my other tabs. But still keep, it still keeps doing that. Okay. I have to make it smaller, actually. Oh, but it looks so pixelated now. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. You, you just don't have to zoom in on it. If you go at a hundred percent, it looks just fine. There's no, there's no weirdly pixelated. <laughs> there's no weird pixels. So it's just fine. I'll have to cut some of the. It's not. We're not the ones that will be zooming in. You're not allowed to zoom in. <laughs> That's illegal. Cannot. Oh, this one should be number five. Wait, why is this number? Number five? Why is this number five? This should be number six. Oh, wait. There you go. Nice. There you go, there you go. That will SVM because it's pink and swims in the anime? But that's only anime logic, though. Okay, so Tyrantrum seems to be winning. You guys will have a little bit more time to go because I still need to sort out how I'm gonna make this work. How I'm gonna make Trancy fit in. Okay, there you go. Invert. And delete. Also, bye bye, Tilly. Thank you for stopping by. Okay, there you go. He's split. It's the best that we get. <laughs> Maybe if I move... There you go. That looks a little better. There you go. Tyrantrum sweeping the pool. Yeah, seems like Tyrantrum is winning. Yeah, Tyrantrum won. There you go. Okay, so Tyrantrum it is. We're getting the T-Rex up here. Okay, need to get a good Tyrantrum picture. That's a good picture. I guess the standard Tyrantrum picture would work. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, save Tyrantrum. Tyrantrum should be the pole due to him being a dragon dance sweeper is pretty fitting. But big neck plan! Unfortunately, Alola and Executor do not win. It was democracy. Okay, there you go. And add here. Wow, we got four done. Almost. <laughs> I think I'm probably gonna make a separate stream another time where I'll actually decorate these, because, um,. I'm not gonna have time. It, it's already been four hours. <laughs> I love democracy this time only. <laughs> only this time. It kind of looks like he's doing the pog phase. I can kind of see it actually. This weekend, we can stay up late. I don't want to do six hours just to actually decorate these. <laughs> I actually thought this was gonna be really short, not gonna lie. I was like, oh, we're gonna sort out the teams, it's gonna be really fast, and like, stream's gonna be an hour, and it's not an hour. <laughs> oh my god, how do I fit Tarantrum in here? I'm gonna have to cut off too much of his face, I don't wanna cut off too much. Why is Tarantrum so hard to make work? I guess kinda like this. I'm gonna cut off a big part of the snout, but if I try to like not cut off too much of the snout, it cuts off too much of the body. 
You're also missing. I know. I know. I'm missing myself. I I, I am missing myself. I haven't done the same for me. Main focus on the head. I guess maybe, yeah. Main focus on the head. Probably be, yeah. Very main focus on the head. It's because every day Tiaki do is high effort. I could have literally just probably like um, done it in a way simpler way, but I thought doing it like these little like trainer cards would have been cute. <laughs> so yeah. I think I made it overly complicated. I like the balance of your creatures with Q1s and Lottie's team. Oh yeah, you got like the little guy, so then you got the the the, the, the big creatures. I've just done on Pokemon Showdown and been done in minutes. True. That would have been a one way. The trainer cards are super cute. It was worth it. I do want to decorate them to fit more like um everyone. But that will have to be for another stream. Not this one. <laughs> Not this stream. Another, another stream. We'll have to leave that for a different time. Just so I can show that a graphic design is, uh, will not be my passion when you actually see me decorate these. <laughs> okay, how do I make you work? <laughs> okay, how do I make this work? Uh... Oh, that's not it. Hide you, select this, then invert, and... Oh, wrong layer. It's just the head at this point. <laughs> it's just the head. I feel like I could cut a little bit more of the snout, actually. I was trying really hard to not cut the snout. Jackie's Pokemon lineup is just Lottie, Nemi, Mian, and Rocky. Oh, yeah, they're... That with their little Pokemon lineups. Head with small hands. I feel like it could cut off the snout a little bit more. And it wouldn't be that bad. I can move it a little bit more forward. I think, yeah. That could. Yeah, that could do. Yeah, I could do it. Also, Tom Lin, thank you so much for this super. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for doing this one stream. Even if it went longer than you thought. Yeah, it definitely went longer than I uh, originally envisioned. <laughs> I was really thinking it was just gonna be like um, one hour, and then it was like, okay, it's over. Bye, guys. <laughs> but it ended up being longer than I thought it would be. But I kind of like doing like these little silly. Ideas of making, uh, I guess things themed to like, uh, I guess things matching like our themes. Like, if we, if I do something related, like, oh yeah, pixels start as something. I think it's really, I think it's a cute idea. Even if I'm not, uh, the most art artistic. <laughs> oh, wrong layer. Uh, uh. If, even if I'm not particularly uh, artistic, I think it's a fun idea to just try it. Hey, you. Oh. you said as if we would hate a longer stream. Hmm. <laughs> not really. Not really. It's very. It's been very fun coming up with all this stuff. I always enjoy these types of streams. I'm glad. I'm glad that you guys seem to like them. There they are. Four have been assembled. The Pokemon were for Tiaki, Porygon. I'm thinking a lot of electric Pokemon. <laughs> Honestly. Without its nose, it looks like a Muppet. Wait, does it? Maybe a little bit. Okay. Uh, it's not enough space. I'm gonna have to delete one. Uh, no, duplicate. Duplicate layer. Yeah, his creativity for his stream knows no bounds. I try. I try to at least to come up with like a one variety stream per week. I'd say the missing bell would be really fitting. Yeah, it's not technically a real Pokemon, yeah. Are we doing you next so I can bat 
Are we doing you next? I came back in time for you. Yes. We're doing mine next. I'm thinking... Uh, I guess I could minimize Nebby since I... She was the first one I made. Okay, let me... I feel like Rotom could make a comeback this time. It could. It actually could. There you go. I did misspell it. This is really fun to see what creators of DSC have for streams. They're always so much fun. I I, I really I try. <laughs> I'm always like, hmm, I need to come up, I need to come up with something, something cool, something nice. And then I, I sit there and brainstorm and see what I can come up with. <laughs> Ooh, but yeah. There you go. You're always a blast to watch. Aw, oh, thank you. Whoops. I minimize Clip Studio Pain. Ignore that. <laughs> Normally I try really much to make them really interesting. But Tiag is gonna be really old Gen 5? Not really, no. Not really. I wouldn't make them all Gen 5 themed. I'm thinking... I'm trying to think, like, electric. I think Botan actually funny enough. I don't know why. One of the ones I'm thinking is Botan. It's an electric doggle. And you guys are, you know, your canines. So I thought Botan would be cute. I thought you accidentally closed it. That would be terrible. <laughs> that would be really terrible, actually. I feel like a rock rock rough is perfect for the cats Not only are they wolves, but their shiny is also blue and white like us. Ooh. That could also be good. I was thinking Bolton because electric doggo. It's electric, so it makes sense. Did you save? I didn't close it. I minimized it. Another electric dog is Manetric. True. That could also be another one. There's a lot of electric doggles. Delete and delete and delete delete and let me see. They look for an Empoleon fits the aesthetic. Do I look that imposing? <laughs> Even better, it does more like a rock for extra coolness. But I think dusk form is not. Is the dusk worm blue? Dusk worm shiny. Oh, it is the blue one. I don't know why I thought it was orange. I think it was because of the anime. <laughs> uh, I was like, wait, why is it like... Where did the orange one come from? But I think it's just the anime. I, I think the shiny one is actually blue. I was like, where did the orange lichen rock come from? I don't know why Ash had an orange one. Uh, orange is the regular color. No, no, no. It's That's brown. The brown one is the regular color. I mean, like, actual orange orange. Like, normal lichen rock is light brown. Orange is the dawn form. I'm going to lose some time based on evolution. No, but that's, that's a light brown. That's not the orange I'm talking about. Oh, from the sunset scene? Yeah. Dusk form is orange. Is it dusk form? Dusk... No, because when I check dusk form shiny... There are three forms, right? Might be suns... Is there a sunset one? Tito like <laughs> I'm trying to find it. Like, okay, here's the image I'm thinking. I think sunset is the dusk form. Normal dusk is orange. Why does it look more... Hmm, midday is light brown, midnight is dark red, dusk is orange. Oh, yeah. It was because it was added for Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. Yeah, that's why it was confusing me. Yeah, because I only remember, like, the... The light brown one. The, and, um... I only remember Midday and Midnight. 
So I was like, why is it, is it or I've never seen it before? I only saw I only saw it in the anime. I was like, didn't play Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. Um, I only played regular Sun and Moon. Yeah, that's because I did later. Yeah, that's what was throwing me off. I was like, what, what is this? This was originally introduced in the anime, if I recall correctly. I thought it was like an anime thing, honestly. Kind of like how Ash Greninja happened, you know? So I was like, why is this suddenly orange? <laughs> but yeah, I think that's what was throwing me off. This is about Pokemon and Ultra Sun and Moon. I don't think you can even catch it in the game. Mm. Makes sense, makes sense. I think all three forms are blue and shiny, though. Hmm. Interesting. The more you know. It was added in the anime, but you can catch it in game now. You can catch it in Scarlet and Violet now, at least. I kind of want to get one. Time to dust off my copy. Oh, I minimized it again. <laughs> the event Pokemon. I think Ash Ninja is actually in the game. I mean, it was an event thing, but it came from the anime, you know. You you can't really obtain a normal Greninja. <laughs> um like that. Yeah, all the shades are blue for some reason. I like blue. I think blue is nice. I'm not saying it because I'm blue. I'm not biased. <laughs> I'm not I'm not biased. I feel like if I say I like blue, they're gonna be like, ah, oh, it's because you're blue, Chiafi. <laughs> No, it's not because I'm blue. I'm not saying it because I'm blue. I'm blue da ba dee da ba da. You're biased though, I'm not! I'm not actually biased. I'm not saying it just because I'm blue. That's not... That's not my reasoning. Oh, wait. Oh, there you go. I found the tab where chat was. I, I accidentally minimized one of my tabs. And it was uh, the chat tab. Ash Green Ninja Form was cut in game after Gen 7, but the ability in Scarlet and Violet. She's blue da ba dee da ba da. She's a blue insider. What do you mean? Not biased. Never. If you say so, I re it's true. I'm not biased. We know it's your favorite because you're blue. <laughs> I mean, it's one of my favorite colors, but. I wouldn't say it's my top favorite, actually. Shocker moment. Your favorite color is not blue. I would say it's one of, but not the top. Shocker moment. You know what else is blue Porygon? I feel Porygon's more pink than blue. The scandal. <laughs> the big scandal of the century. Her top favorite color is not blue. How will we ever recover from this? There she is. So what is your favorite? I actually really like purple. <laughs> I would say purple is like one of my favorite colors. The top favorite, actually. I meant shiny Porygon. You didn't specify. There she is in all her glory. Purple's base, that's acceptable. <laughs> Good taste, the blue VTuber does not have blue as a favorite. <laughs> It's one of my favorites. Blue is one of my favorites, but purple's my top favorite. Purple Chiaki one. Imagine, one day you wake up and Chiaki's purple. What would you do? <laughs> purple's both blue and red at the same time. But it's not only blue. <laughs> Where did it? Wait. Oh, that's not the right one. I put it here. Oh, Chiaki. I gotta shrink myself. I gotta become pixelated too. Oop. Funnily enough, Poco said the same thing. Wait, did Poco also say that her favorite color was not blue? I was creepy because the character frequently draws literally a purple Chiaki. <laughs> Purple Chiaki might be more real than you think. Chiaki being purple, I would I would cry, I guess. It's my usual answer to things I don't understand. <laughs> purple Chiaki would be the mix of Chiaki and evil Chiaki. She's the chaotic neutral Chiaki. Truly purple. 
I want to cut off my cat ears. Everything else can go. I'm biased like that. <laughs> yeah, Poco said her favorite co color was purple. What a coincidence. Got the ears. Totally not biased over here. There you go. Okay. Then here. Not the cat ears. The cat ears are not gonna be cropped. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. She's not gonna lose her cat ears. Rip ears in a one set of ear of a whole kid. <laughs> She's gonna have. It's just gonna be cropped a little bit. There you go. Oh, whoops. I forgot to fully delete this. There you go. There you go. Bada bim, bada boom. There she is. She has so much volume with her jacket. <laughs> I do have an oversized jacket. What can I say? What can I say? Chiaki must protect her hide. What do you mean? It's your chaotic neutral purple Chiaki. Her jacket is like half her weight. <laughs> what do you mean? You're, you're saying that this jacket is that heavy? Oh, spooky music time. Okay, can we pick something less scary? Come on, you two. I said something less scary. Ah, okay, this works, whatever. <laughs> this works. She has the spooky music because she's scary. We need spooky music, why? You don't need spooky music. So that's how Chiaki goes to light speed. She takes off her jacket. <laughs> Maybe. Hmm, let's see. Maybe Porygon Z could work? It actually has a little bit of my colors. It has like the blue and it has like the little the pink that I have. The pink accents. Mine is one centimeter of a whole because she's now 148. That's not minus one, that's minus two. Uh, what do you mean? That's not that's not reducing minus one. You're reducing minus two. Don't think I didn't see that. <laughs> not slick. Hmm, <laughs> Jackie doesn't go to light speed, she goes to ludicrous speed. You see me, now you don't. So hi hi, lock on space. Welcome, welcome. Okay, so hear me out. Glacian for Chiaki. It's blue, it's sassy, it kinda got her hair <laughs> Wait, Glacian's cute. Keki's getting smaller. What do you mean? We're all getting smaller. Electric type Pokemon. I'm trying to see if there's any electric types that kind of fit me. Are there any electric cats? I don't think there are. Hmm. I don't really see that. What, Noivern? Noivern? Why Noivern? Jolteon? We count Eevee Evolutions as cats. Jolteon is the closest. Yeah, I feel Jolteon might be the closest. I was trying to think for like a starter. Like what, what we could pick as a starter. Noivern has boombox here. <laughs> Looks like a lion. Isn't it supposed to be a lynx rather than a lion? Like Shinx, Luxray. Hmm, is there anything to think? You see the vibe that you'll have a Noivern. Really? Okay, so I'll add Porygon as one of them. I don't know what the starter would be, but I'll add Porygon Z. Porygon Z. Shinx, Luxray, Luxray. Shinx, maybe. I think Luxray is just based in big cats in general. You'll pick Porygon? I think Porygon is fitting, but I don't think I'll have it as a starter since I'm picking Porygon Z. I think Porygon Z is more fitting. I'll put Porygon Z maybe a second. Porygon Z. 
Porygon feels mandatory in some form. Yeah, Porygon is fitting, so it has to be there. In some shape or form. Jinx has more starter energy, really? I feel like this one has to have a lot more head present. Oh, Mewtwo. <laughs> but we're not really going for legendaries, though. Mewtwo's a legendary. Feels too... too biased. For me to have a legendary. Are you okay with bugs? I don't really like bugs. Especially not spiders like Galvantula. <laughs> Are we having any tomfoolery, Galarian Mr. Mime? Why Mr. Mime? Anything but Mr. Mime. Nah, Mr. Mime. I don't appreciate Mr. Mime. Oh, why is the eraser so tiny now? Okay, it almost fit. Pretty good fit. Zero Aura looks pretty cat like, also has zoomies. Isn't that a legendary though? <laughs> But cut your bro, she hates us and our level 4 caterpies and we. <laughs> uh, did we mention Rhoda? One of the forms could work. Sarah Aura is a legendary man. People is a sorry hassle hoodie? Zorua because Tiaki is tuny. Zorua is one of my favorite Pokemon, but. <laughs> oh man. Beach is mythical, not legendary. I mean, any Pokemon that are rare, you can only get one of. Um, I would honestly put Manaphy, uh, Fiona in the same category as, like, we're not gonna add those. Even if you can get Fiona by just breeding Manaphy. I think it's just a type of legendary. Yeah. I can't have legendary the creator for this. It's only natural to spam legends. No, I'm not biased. Okay. Let's see. Uh, what was it? Oh yeah, Glacy. Glaceon was one of them. I think Glaceon's cute. Someone mentioned Glaceon. I think it was Raps. It's very blue. I can kind of see the hair deal. <laughs> I can kind of actually see it with the hair. The Glaceon. Dragonite? Why Dragonite? Very, very blue. Very da ba dee da ba da. I got the system Tiaki and I let his dear team. No. I'm playing it fair and square. I think Leaper can work with Tiaki. It's smug. A gremlin has pranksters and ability to be her menace personality. <laughs> oh. He gets Dragonite because Gen 1 lands had illegal Dragonite, so he's a hacker. <laughs> oh, not the illegal Dragonites. <laughs> okay, Glaceon. Meow, they so you coded. It's Tiaki coded. Really? Meow? When I think of Meow, they only think of anime Meow. So I'm like, how? I, I don't see Meow. Hi, dragon because of color. It's too spooky. <laughs> it's too too spooky five me. Glaceon. It's a little gremlin. Tiak and Meowth are like exactly the same. <laughs> are we? Are we really? Oh, I forgot to delete this. Whoops. Anime Meowth. Rotom could work since the thing that possesses appliances, which is sort of like hacking. Actually, yeah, Rotom could actually work. Yeah, you're pretty similar. Hmm. I might have to shrink this a bit more. It's too big. I don't like this. Hmm, Spinarak, he's a web crawler. I don't like spiders though. <laughs> Rude of you because she microwaves. <laughs> oh no, not the microwave Rodom. I don't mm, how do I make Glaceon fit? 
I need to actually make it bigger and just have it be more head. I think it might have to be something like this. Yeah, might just have to be something like this. Spooky cat hackers don't mix. Why? You don't think I'm spooky terrifying and very scary skeletons? I would like to think I'm very terrifying. <laughs> very terrifying and scary and spooky. Dun dun dun. Check it like the web but not the spider. <laughs> I just don't like spiders. I don't appreciate them. We just do not get along, you know? Take is only scary when you're on the couch too much. <laughs> yeah, you're terrifying. Thank you, thank you. I know, I know. I am indeed very scary. Mm hmm, mm hmm. Not for anything. I am the mastermind. The one with the plan. Like the spooky music says Electivire. Oh, the little elect... Oh, this creature. <laughs> uh, hmm. I was thinking more of the... Ma... What's the name? Was it Ranger the Mastermind? No, I've always been the Mastermind. I don't know if Electivire... I'm thinking of different electric. So 2D Steven has her BDM for spookiness? It was actually just lucky. <laughs> I'm so for the evil vibes. You think I'm evil? Some people might actually think because I did listen to Linkin Park and I had a little bit of that era where I actually really enjoy that type of music, but I blame my brother for it. Purloin, <laughs> uh, cat, purple, smug, and dark chewy. <laughs> At that point, might as well just go for Zorua. You also love sad stories, don't forget that. <laughs> oh, that is true. So evil. <laughs> You have evil in your blood at any rate. Hey, Katsubro getting tossed under the bus. <laughs> uh, I can see Purloin, actually. My god, I, I forget how sassy Purloin is, but... Sure, I'm adding Purloin. Which one's the most violent Pokemon? I don't think there's a... Definitive? Violent Pokemon? Per se? Sassy cat just like Tiaki. <laughs> Bro. And then for Zorwark. Ooh, Zorwark would be really cute. Zorwark is kind of cool. I like Zorwark. Okay. Expel Primate Beedrill? Plus the violent ones. And he ape is pretty valid. Gyarados, not Gyarados. I think Gyarados is too much. Okay, Perloin. Do we need more sassy than Surprier? So Rick just works. It's simple to mess with people like Tiak, and it's quite clever. Transforms into others, so you could call that social hacking. Where would we put Perloin though? I don't think where would he put Perlon? How about more Pekoi? How's an evil melee? Mm -hmm. First, I don't. Ugh, do I really have to put the, the 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 sassy cat as my starter? I mean, I guess it fits in a way. Perlon's only in one stage, right? Yeah, it's a, it's a it has a evolution leap part. Yes, fine. <laughs> I guess. I guess I'll put Sassy Cat as my starter. It, I guess it is kind of fitting. Imagine your opponent attacks and sees two Sassy Cats in the arena. <laughs> Not like this. <laughs> Probably makes sense. The one's got a weird sense of deja vu. I guess Perloin makes sense, yeah. Perloin there. And this. Purple wants you to find a difference in these two images. They're the same image. Oh no. 
I will now become Perlon. Yeah, can Perlon make a great do? <laughs> okay, there you go. We have Perlon, Porygon, Porygon Z, and Glaceon. For Emo, I'm surprised nobody suggested Absol. Tiaki Purr. I could, but I refuse to do so. <laughs> I can't unsee. I'm like, I'm not gonna be Tiaki Sleeper to represent the Katsunos being even more violent than her. <laughs> I, I think Shiny Lycanroc actually works for the Katsunos. It has the blue and the and the white. So I think Shiny Lycanroc will be pretty good. Tiaki Purring would kill our viewers. She has to hold that. <laughs> I, I, I refuse to do so. We're not violent, are we? Next question. I agree to that, especially since Dust is the most violent of the three. Shiny, Lycan, Rug, Dust. Hey, glorious one. Zoroark, the Pokemon, single-handedly responsible for most accusations of hacking. <laughs> okay, shiny... Like rock. Embrace our violent nature, brothers. Hmm, <laughs> I can see it. Okay, there you... There you are. Put you guys here. Add... Over in... This and I'm gonna have to shrink. Ah, I moved the this there. I crave violence. So right, rude. I'm shiny like around all our good options. They are, yeah. A lot of good options. Oh my god. I need to find a way to make it fit. I feel like maybe this position go to work. We're cutting a bit less of the claws. Maybe? Hmm. This this could work. This could work. We'll have to see it. I have to see it to see if it'll actually work. Okay, invert. Okay, now moment of truth. I think it works actually. It's gonna be, but we need to crop it to see it for sure. I think it looks good, actually. Yeah, that looks good. Focus on the edgy eyes. <laughs> okay, there you go. Okay, looking sweet. Nice. Okay, now we need two more. No way, it could look better, to be honest. Really? I feel like if I zoom in too much, it's gonna look, um... It's gonna be more face, and it's not gonna show the rest of the body. I need more Judy Pokemon. <laughs> more Chuni. Absol for Chuni Mon. I feel like that would be too many dark types. We need more electric types. Electric type. I feel like I'm missing way more electric types. Rodom. Let me see what type. Uh, what Rodom types? It's basically Sasuke. <laughs> uh, there's... The... the Wasn't Gothic Lolita style... Wasn't there a Gothic Lolita style Pokemon? There is, yeah. The... Gotharita. Gothitelle. Mm-hmm. Very out there. Choice. Medicus for Tiaki to have a supercomputer for her hacking. <laughs> Mmm, but Metacross is more robot y than computer y. But none of the Rodom forms truly fits. Not the land mower, not the fridge, not the oven. Mythic though. Oh, is, is Rodom still a mythic? Or is it still easy to get? It has to be base Rodom. Mmm, I guess base Rodom could also work. Mmm, base Rodom. 
Nah, you can you can even breed it. I think it's kind of violet. You can catch it like a normal mon. Mm, remember some of mythic? He never was. He was just rearish. Hmm. Honestly, I think just base road on works better. I think it's easier to get them Porygon. Really? I don't think Porygon is like considered a legendary though. Just a regular Rotom for like an electric type. Rotom. Uh, we'll add it on the third slot. Nah, we'll add it on the fifth one. I think fifth slot. The fifth slot works a little better, actually. Bum 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 bum. Add Rodom here. Then just crop it. Move them right here. We're now to shrink. Okay. So, what are our suggestions for the final slot? <laughs> the the big final slot. What are what are we thinking? What are we cooking? That's the, the big question. I vote for Zoroark still. I think Zoroark's pretty cool. Kind of fit the, the hacking illusions. I can kind of see it. Metagross sounds cool. Just another solid contender. Mr. Mime? Uh, I don't really think Mr. Mime fits. You guys were on fan for the funny since he's flying time, but also has levitate can hold an air balloon. <laughs> I think it's just normal Rodom. It's too neat, it's kinda hacking, it's too neat, it kinda looks like a mastermind. And it's too neat. <laughs> You're just adding it because of Tuni. Mr. Mime? No! Not Mr. Mime. Mr. Mime is bad. It has nothing to do with my theme, and I don't like it. <laughs> Absolute Lucario, Alola, and Sandslash. Tentacril because Jackie bullies all Tentacril is bad. No. Mr. Certain, no. Dude, why J Fluid? How about Zorwork? We have Zorwork. Absol. Absol could be cool. I guess Zorwork, Absol, um. I would say Bolton, because but we already have it. Well, uh, this is more ghost electric rather than electric main type. I'm thinking more bolt on. If you go with Mr. Mime, I feel the file will mysteriously vanish. <laughs> Gramble works well. Uh, isn't there another fairy type that's not Gramble? <laughs> oh no, fairy type Pokemon. Yeah, and all the fairy types really, really match me. Station Buddy's legendary, it all comes back to the fact that they're legendaries. Yeah, none of, none of the fairy types really fit me. Or Gramble immediately reject it? I don't, I don't really like how Gramble look. <laughs> Snowball! Snowball just looks like a grandma's dog, and I don't really like it. <laughs> it Ranger's not a bulldog, no. He's, he's based on a Doberman, not on a bulldog. We don't need a spider, no. No spider. Where's the shiny lichen rug? Where's Rodom? Uh, where you gonna be? Where is? Where did I add it? Oh, here he is. There you are. Then this here. Houndu. <laughs> Houndu is way too, way too edgy. Way, way, way too edgy. A bit too much. Feels more like a demon dog. I don't. I don't. Not really. I'm not really demon dog ish. Okay, there you go. There's Rodom. It's about there's so chihuahua. <laughs> okay, so it was uh which one? We got Absol Zoroark. 
bold tongued Nicket? Mm, I feel like we got too many dark vibes. No looks right. It has wall hack eyes. The Judy saying the dog is too edgy. <laughs> it's too much. I guess these four. Lux I guess Luxray, sure. We can add Luxray. Okay, there you go. Absol, Zoroic, Bolton, or Luxray. There there are your four four choices. There they are. And now the moment of truth. Bum, 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 bum. Ba, 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 ba. Dun, da, 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 da. Zurich or Absol is gonna win. You know what we need to do? Cause a tie. No, no ties. No ties. How long has it been? Oh, it's almost gonna be five hours. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. I the pool. Zorik is the best. I really like Zorik. It's one of my favorites. Pretty cool. Pretty neat. May the edgiest win. Okay, 20, 21. And... Three, two, one. Bow. No, it's it's been it's over. Where did it go? I wait. Did luxury? Oh, there you go. <laughs> uh, you trying to end before five hours? Yes, I'm trying to end before five hours. Yeah, luxury one. Okay, luxury it is. Luxury. Yeah, luxury ended up winning at the end. Let's see, I'm gonna add luxury. Curse you, so you revolted, didn't you? <laughs> I'm not even sure how you can revolt. Only five hours? What do you mean, only? What do you mean, only? I need slot number three. This one. Shiny or not? I would say normal one, not really shiny one. Shiny one is yellow, so... I say normal one's good. Finally, I win one. <laughs> Unless you use all the counts, it's impossible to revote. Unless people are literally just making all the counts for this. We saw Rick and suddenly it went down and Luxray got bigger. Yeah, I saw Sorik was winning for a little bit. And then it just, um... Luxray just won out of nowhere. Big numbers, to be honest. Five hours? What do you mean? You say that as if it's the norm to stream for that long. Okay. I feel like it's too much body, actually. I say saw they were tied. Too bad that wasn't the case. Yeah. I feel like I'm gonna have to do much head. Yeah, I feel doing more head for Luxray might work better. It's because of how big his head is. Uh, not yet, it's normal. The average stream left does keep going up. Not like this. I focus on the punk hairstyle. <laughs> uh, yeah, I feel like I'm gonna have to... focus on the punk hairstyle more. Okay, then... Make this and select that. Okay, I see the vision. And then invert. And then da -da 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 there you go, just like that. There you go, putty putty. You got it. Is not your for you stream less than six? I, it's very rare when I stream more than six hours, I'll have you know. It's only been very few times. Can I go to your favorite Mega? Mega Altaria. Mega Altaria is my favorite Mega. It's really cute, really like that fluffy dragon bird. And it's funny that you're not even the one that streams the longest. So you're shouldn't too like longer than how, from how funny they are. 
I mean, I don't know if I'm the one that streams the longest out of all of us, out of Pixel Start, but... I guess I do stream for quite a bit. Now the streaming space, the stream can truly begin. What do you mean this stream can truly begin? I'm not gonna decorate these right now. Next time. You're doing great. Just do not check... Do not check tags your tags. Wait, what do you mean by that? What do you mean do not check tags your tags? It's time for the post stream Isatsu, right? What do you mean? This entire stream was Isatsu. You're gonna stream longer with Elden Ring. I mean, yeah, but Elden Ring's a pretty... Pretty demanding game. Yeah, every stream's been 12 hours since debut without gaslighting. Do you think I would really fall for that one? What about Taurus PC? <laughs> Oh my god. I don't even know what Pokemon Tora likes. It, uh, they'll all just be cats. <laughs> They're like, just cats. Just pick like every every cat Pokemon. And just... Pick your, your top favorite six cats. And that's it. <laughs> I don't know what would I even do for Tora's team. I don't know what Pokemon he likes. A cat team. All oh, the comfy cats. <laughs> Can we make something official as Pokemon later? Rabbi gets all the legendaries. <laughs> Give it you too. <laughs> oh my god. It's just all Meowth and Persian forms. Oh my god. <laughs> oh no. But yes, that's it. It's 450. You're not getting the 10 extra minutes. So, yes. I actually have to go eat. <laughs> <laughs> it's like almost not it's almost 10 over here. It's 9 9:49. So I need to go eat. <laughs> I haven't had food ever since uh lunch actually. <laughs> hey recruits, welcome. Not even just a do six legendaries. He gets all of them. <laughs> oh my god. You require food? I do. Please your majesty, we beg you. I need to eat. <laughs> Oh, so Raps, thank you so much for the five gifted. Thank you, thank you. Thanks for the stream. Very fun stream. Yeah. It, it was fun. I, I really like doing these um these Pokemon cards. I would like to decorate them at another at another um date. But that date shall be later. Mm -hmm. Because for now I need to eat. So let me see. Who's love? Bum, 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 bum. Uh, oh, Neil's live. I never get to catch her live. Just ten more minutes, please, my lady. No, bye. <laughs> oh my god. I thank you for this soup, but don't win. Thanks for the stream, Tiago. It's lots of fun. I love these types of streams. Can't wait for the decorations. We'll, we'll, we'll get there. We'll get there. But... Here is... The raid mess. Oh god, my... There. Here is the raid message. Okay, here you go. There you go. There's the raid message. And now, I go eat. Hopefully you have a good rest of your day, night, afternoon. Whichever time it is for you. But, yeah. Your highness and promise double the taxes for next month. <laughs> uh, no, I need to eat. <laughs> But thank you for this soup. <laughs> now I go for realsies. Don't don't try to stop me. Okay. Bye bye. Bye bye bye. Tell bye.